All right, I'm back. Sorry about that. Get a drink. Make a new green tea. But I'm here now. How you guys doing? All right, so how this is gonna work things here. Turn that music off. Um, should I do like a OST in the background? What do you guys think? Because here's how this is going to work. I This tier list that I found has every single boss across the entire franchise, all franchises. Uh, so I need to, obviously it's been a while since I've played any of these games. I remember all these fights, but I have a bunch of videos over here of all just the boss fights so I can just kind of scrub through and be like all right yeah 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 that's that, that that's that person okay sure so I I just need a refresher sometimes all the dark souls 2 stuff you guys did not see me play I did that off stream so without further ado let's get an OST on what do you guys think any uh, anything reaching out to you Anything doing it for you? Could put on the Bloodborne OST, that seems fitting. We'll switch it up in a minute. Okay. I don't want to be too loud. Okay, so that can just stay on. This is the Bloodborne OST. Without further ado. Here we go. So, take a look. Here's what I got for you. I've got... Uh, let me just make sure I got it correctly. You. And this correctly as well. Which I do. Okay. So, here we go. There's a lot here. I can grow a little bit. Should I be in the bottom? There are a shitload of names. This is gonna be- this is gonna be difficult. We are going to start with Demon Souls. He's growing. Is that better? A little bit of white on either side, or no? That's good right there, okay. Okay. So, we're gonna start with Demon Souls. I need a refresher because I have no fucking idea. The refresher is, by the way, I have all the Demon Souls fights right here. So let's get started. Let me do the ones that I know for certain, absolutely. These are how I feel the best from software bosses. The criteria. Game mechanic wise. How cool they looked. How, like their animation style. The damage they did. How angry I got, right? Like, what was the most universal best fight I've done in any of these games? I can already tell you which what the first one is. Uh, Ludwig from Bloodborne, is by far, uh, I'm not going to say it yet, but I think it's the best fight they've ever done. Where's the soundtrack? Alright, so we're going to go down to Bloodborne. Here we are. This is going to be so hard. This is going to be way harder than I think. Okay. Where is, there is, okay. i got to move you all the way up here. For those of you that don't know this fight, it's the best fight From Software's ever done. The second phase of this fight had an amazing reveal. Uh, he, I don't want, do I, I don't necessarily need to spoil too much. The music is incredible. It's, it's a full package. The boss fight is not too frustrating. The first phase kind of is. So we know that's there. 100%. The other one that's going up in S, let me see if I can remember if I can find it, is from Dark Souls 3. DLC, uh, Slave Knight Gale. 
absolutely the, one of the probably probably the second or third. It's probably the second best fight they've ever done. Right here. I think well, let's just get the S's done first. I mean, I'm gonna put. Let's get Gwyn up here immediately, right? Like, I, I, I come on, Gwyn. Like that was. I don't know if that. Mm, I think Gwyn is probably a B. I think it's only it would be a C if it wasn't for the the the, the come on Gwyn. All right, now what are the S guaranteed S's? Where's Horalu? Horalu from Elden Ring. I gotta say, it's probably top. It's got to be at least A or S. That whole fight was amazing. I've never felt so involved and my heart was just boom, 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 boom. I was not annoyed. I was not mad. I was just truly in the zone. It was really, really fun. All right, where is Horalu? Uh, it's got to be pretty far down here, right? Oh yeah, this 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 part. Let's let's turn it up. Orlu. Oh, I can also make sure I do the, the ones that are literally zero. That are like the worst I've ever done. Let's do the, the top ones first. Where are you? There's so many names. There you go, alright. Oralu slash Godfrey, it is technically the same fight. That's going up to S. Who else belongs at S? I don't know if any of the Dark Souls 2 bosses are going to be even A. I don't think so. I'm trying to remember. You know who else I need to put pretty high? Where is it? Bloodborne. Why is Brain Sucker a boss? The Brain Sucker wasn't a boss. Um, I knew this was gonna be hard. Ebritas, Ebritas was. I don't think it's S, but I, I'm gonna say B. Ebritas was really cool. That was just one of those reveal fights where you walk in the door. And it's just like, you it's so scary that this thing is even down here. The fight was eh, but I think the reveal was pretty cool. Uh, where is... Oh, all the Sekiro bosses. Oh, fuck all the Sekiro bosses. Yeah, I think all the Sekiro bosses are gonna be C or lower. Although, probably not. We have to take a look. I might need a refresher. We should probably go one game at a time. All right, let me let's get a refresher here. So this is Old Monk. I forget what Old Monk was. Old Monk. Power Knight, Flame Lurker. No, is Old Monk even on here? Was Old Monk even a boss fight? Old Monk. What do you got? What happened here? Forget this fight. Old Monk is the invader. Oh, right, right, right. I need a refresher, though. I mean, what the fuck? Let's go. Hello? Oh, there we go. Okay. So what happens here? It's the guy that invades you. Oh, with all the chairs. I forgot about Yeah, this wasn't that bad. Oh yeah, he had the funny hat on. Okay. Wasn't he really, really easy? Okay, this guy was stupid. Yeah, this guy was pretty stupid. Um, he did have the funny hat on though. Comedy hat puts you in C. Uh, where is the spider? Armor spider. C. Alright, I, I, if you want a refresher on the armor spider, here you go. The one where you had to go down the hallway. This oh, I hated this. This was stupid. Yeah. It starts back here. Yeah, this boss was. Oh, this was awful. Yeah, this is going way lower. Yeah. 
Now fuck this boss. Oh shit, here comes gas coin. Might as well put gas coin now because this music is playing. But let's, uh, uh, yeah, armor's D. That fight was awful. Okay, let's, uh, let's get gas coin up there because he was probably A. It's gonna be very bloodborne. It's gonna be bloodborne heavy at the top. Uh, where's gas coin? Cleric beast? I gotta put. Okay. One of the only times you're gonna see a bloodborne boss be, like, somewhere near F is cleric beast. This boss was just stupid. There's like a. You fight it on the bridge. It takes up the whole bridge. It's annoying. This boss sucked. Cleric beast was awful. It just. I don't like if you're fighting the things on like the tiny little bridges where they take up the whole thing. Although this these have these might change, but where's uh where's gas coin? Oh the gas coin. Alright, this fight was awesome. The change into uh, well it's good. Let's put let's put it at A. Put pinwheel at S. Pinwheel is let's do that now, F. Hold on, stick with Demon Souls for now. The Adjuncticator. What's the Adjuncticator? Oh, Phalanx, this is F. Right, yeah, this boss was stupid. Yeah, this thing was terrible. Why is this lagging? Why is it lagging? Yeah, that's gonna go probably F or lower. Because the fight was just, you just, it's a huge blob and the spears just stick out. You, you're not even fighting a boss, you're just fighting a big annoying thorn bush. It's stupid. Uh, that was Phalanx. F. Okay, let me make sure this is right so far. Yep. Oh, Sif! Wait, we're not, just stay in Demon Souls. We're not, I don't want to jump around. Except for I, the ones that I know are going in F, which, where's Millennia? Millennia is 100% F. Wait, hold on. Tibia Mariner, we're going to get this one done right now, too. The Tibia Mariner was like C, though, because it was funny. Molting. The Millennia fight was one of the worst things I've ever done in a Souls game. And I know I said that for uh, Ishin, but nope. No, Ishin is better. Ishin's going down there too, though, don't worry. Um. Where are you? Godskin duo. I like the Godskin stuff, but I feel like they've showed up way too often. Well, I'll put Godric. We'll do Godric. I actually really liked that fight. The music is great. He laughs. He guys. He has like a ha 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 ha. I like his move set, but I think wait, it's not going today. I would say B plus for now. For now. Let's stay in uh, in Demon Souls. I'm I'm going to all over the place. Adjunct Cater. What is it? Where is that? Was this the thing with big tongue? It was like a big fat guy, right? Yeah, yeah, I remember this. Wasn't this the fight that you had to st yeah, you had to stand up here and throw shit at it? F. Yeah, tiny room, huge boss is already a C below. Yeah. This is it at least a D? I'm to all the tiny room huge bosses are going to get at least C or minus. Old hero. What was old hero? Right here. 
music's too intense for me. This is, I think this music's too intense. What do you think? Another, another hallway boss, which I'm not a big fan of. I think this guy actually had a pretty cool moveset, though, from what I remember. I, I remember this guy being fun to fight against. What else did he do? Yeah, we need like Animal Crossing music or something. This is like, I feel like I need to be screaming at you. Yeah, I, this, this was solid. I remember, this was solid. Yeah, let's put on like, yeah, let's put on like Stardew Valley or something. Stardew Valley. That's like an easy listening. I don't know. I've done, oh, 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 oh. It's like I feel like I need to be. I need to be like I said, run. Everybody run. Hey, there we go. Now we can do it. All right. Get back to this. Uh, I'm gonna put. Old hero in C. Storm King. Storm King, let's see. What was this one? I don't remember this at all. And you're probably wondering, why do you not have the Demon Souls remastered shit up here? Because I haven't played it yet, and I don't, I, I'm going to probably eventually. Oh, yeah, it was a giant moth. Yeah, this is cool. It was This was a gimmick fight? How much of a gimmick was it, though? That's the manta ray. The Stardew Valley music makes this, like, weird. <laughs> it was a gimmick fight? Yeah. Oh, didn't I hate this? I talked a lot of shit about this. I think I distinctly said this was awful. Yeah. Yeah, this was... You had to get the cyclone thing and... <laughs> it, was, yeah, it was freaking loud, too. Yeah, that's not that great. All right, so I know Storm King. Uh, let's, what about Leechmonger? We'll do three or four of them. Leechmonger is here. This, uh, this is the one where when you just being in the room, you got hurt. I uh, yeah, I hated this. Yeah, and there was no rhyme or reason to that move at all. His arms just like flail around. Yeah, this fight was absolute dog shit. <laughs> Somebody said Demon Souls had some real stinkers. Yeah. Yeah, that was terrible. Okay. Dirty Colossus. Which one was this one? Honestly, I don't even remember fighting this. I'm gonna have to put this at D because I don't remember. I don't even remember this being in the game. Okay, so cool. Uh, so Storm King, that was pretty. That was pretty gimmicky. I don't think it's F though. Mmm, it's pretty stupid. Leechmonger F. Dirty Colossus. I'm gonna give it an F too because I don't even remember it playing it. We're almost through Demon Souls. Where's Flame Lurker? I remember Flame Lurker. You know how I remember Flame Lurker? 
because I beat this first try. Everyone was really, really confused that I was able to do it. This fight was really bad, but just because I beat it first try does not mean it's a good fight. Let me get refreshed on this again. This is the guy that had all the explosions. He jumped around a lot, right? Let's get some, let's refresh. Yeah, this thing jumps all over the place and explodes. Mm, it's cool, but yeah, those explosions were so horrible. Even though I did beat a first try. Way too dank, what? Can't even hear anything. Alright, so I remember with that. I'm, I'm gonna keep it in B. Maiden Astria. I don't remember this fight either. And if I don't remember you, that means you're probably down on the list really low. It's two. Maiden Astria and Garl Vindland? What, who the, what the fuck was this? Uh, what? I don't... How could you forget this? <laughs> I just need to refresh my memory before I can tell you. I don't remember doing this. This is a sanctuary for the lost and wretched. There is nothing here for you to pillage or plunder. Please. Wait, what? Hold on, you just get you just walk down here and just kill her? This is, alright, I don't know about this. I don't think this deserves to be anywhere higher than C. And, but, but wait a minute. It's a story boss? Okay. What about the, uh, the penetrator? Penetrator? Where's the penetrator? Dude, there's no penetrator. Where's the penetrator? Does it go by another name? I went over it? Old monk, man eater, fool's idol. Oh, penetrator. Okay, I'm stupid. Oh, I remember. Yeah, this was fun. Give me a link to the list. I will in a second. I mean, kind of forgettable, but still fun. I summoned an NPC on accident. Okay. Old King. All right, I remember the, the Old King was a good, was a cool fight. Whisper request. Okay. This is one of the last fights in the game. Mhm. Mm this was cool. This was an easy last boss, but I don't think it was a bad fight. It was a fun fight. Yeah, this was cool. Let me do something else later as well. Is grab low as your soul level, right? 
cool. Okay. Any more refreshers that I need before I do the rest of Demon Souls? Uh, Primeval Demon, I think I need to see. I'm going to need this especially with the Demon Soul stuff. It's been a long time. Did I go over it again? Primeval Demon. I don't think this one's on here. It's not an official boss. Oh. I don't remember this one. Turn the music off? You never saw Primeval Demon. Oh, shit. Okay. Turn it up. <laughs> it only spawns if you fuck the world up enough. Alright. Well, then I can't place it. I'm just gonna put it down at, um... I'll add a category. That says... We'll call it... Um, I don't know is the category. Well, they didn't do it. All right, only a couple more that I need to remember. But let's actually let's let's go back to this and do these ones. Hi. Okay. Let's do Primeval Demon. I didn't do it. That maiden fight was. I mean, if you want to talk about in the entirety of all of. From software. Running down a hallway and killing five or six regular enemies to kill this lady that's sitting on the ground. I don't think compares with, uh, like, Father Gascoin. Okay? But is that better than the Phalanx? Yeah. Is that better than Storm King? No. Cleric Beast is better than Armor Spider. Armor Spider's a joke. All right, Penetrator. Storm King also was a good narrative. Yeah. I'll put this at C. All the, okay, all the guy that has a, a sword in his hand are probably going to all be C. I like this fight. I'm going to put it at B. It might change. Vanguard Demon. This is the, um, this is the, the Asylum Demon, right? Yeah, it is. I mean, it's... Put on Majula. Oh, yeah, actually, you know, I'll put on Dark Souls 2. Let's get a great OSD. Put on Majula? Yeah. I'll do that. Uh, Vanguard is probably like D. Stardew Valley, like, yeah, it doesn't fit. But nothing, what does fit right now? Okay, give me a sec. Uh, where is it? I have it down here. Majula. Majula extended. Ooh, okay. Alright. This might be the best hub world music. Without, yeah, that's probably the best one. All right, uh, Vanguard Demon is, I really want to put it in an F, but it's a tutorial boss, so it kind of can't be there. I don't know. What do you guys think? It's a tutorial boss. Should any tutorial boss be allowed to be over D? I don't think so. But that's a better fight than the maiden fight. The maiden fight is just is is a better at least you actually fight. Mm. I'll keep it here for now. Oh, there's also regular King Alant, right? I already know where I'm putting like half of these, by the way. I just saw this and immediately wanted to put it like down here. Okay, what is what's regular Alant? Well, let's let's look at the rest of these. 
Blue Dragon. Old King Alant? King Alant. Was this the actual last fight? I don't remember. Wait, is this when you kill the, the thing in one hit? This was fucking stupid. This was fucking stupid. Why is he talking like the TikTok filter? Okay, that's not a good fight. I mean... So... Um, what about Blue Dragon? Blue Dragon and Red Dragon. Power Knight was kind of, eh. It's like all the giants in Elden Ring. Oh yeah, you could go up top. This was actually pretty fun. Let me get some more gameplay here. Yeah, this was cool. I remember it was a pain in the ass to kill the uh, this stuff up top. How come it's so long? I think this is the guy who took a long time to kill it. Yeah, no, this is cool. I remember this. It was it was intense. It was exhilarating. Uh, so, the dragon, the dragons were not technically bosses. I don't, did I fight them? I don't remember. At least I can do these ones at this point. Okay. King Alant is F, but it's a funny F. It's not like a zero, right? Oh, you want to link, right? Hold on. This is the one I'm using right now. Okay. I don't even, why did I have to turn the screen off for that? Tower Knight. Okay, was Tower Knight better than Penetrator? Yes. Was Tower Knight better than Old Hero? Yes. Was Tower Knight better than the Tibia Mariner? Wait, actually, Tippy Mariner. Mm. I'm gonna say no. No. I'll have to re. I have to think about that again. I just know what's going there, so why not? But Pinwheel King King Alon has to go all the way back here. At least these are fights. Mm, but that's funny. He makes funny sounds. Oh, I'm gonna burp. That's the worst. I think that actually might be the worst thing from Software has ever made. I think so. The Beta Chaos, I think, is truly just. They just mushed a bunch of stuff together and just pressed upload. It's so awful. It's just not even close, I don't think. That whole area was just, um, they just rushed through it as fast as possible. That's, that's probably the worst thing they've ever done. So I know that. I'm, I'm, I'm going ahead, I know. I'm going ahead, I know. The Mario slide? Yeah, I, I hated that shit. Yeah, that's definitely where it belongs. Okay. Oh, wait, let me, let's go back. Let me, re let's refresh. Dragon God fucking blows. Is that the one where it's just you... It's like a cutscene, right? This is a cutscene, boss. Am, am I accurate on saying that? This I remember it's a cutscene. 
Yeah, this is pretty awful. It's the stealth one. Yeah, no, I remember that. It was dumb. Is it on the video? Dragon God, right? I think it was. Yep. Yeah, he spits the fire everywhere. This is not even a boss. He goes near Bed of Chaos. Yes, all right. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is down here. He, he's got one hit kills. He looks cool. I am taking coolness into consideration. But not that much. It's definitely cooler than Better Chaos. Okay, so I know what that is. Fool's Idol. Saw that down here, right? What was this one? Oh, then the church, right? The floor traps. Yeah, this thing sucks too. And again, another one of my big problems with From Software games, I don't like fighting a boss in a corridor that is like just one kind of straight line and a bunch of shit in the way. You, yeah, you can get stuck. Spell casting. Uh huh. And like the MIDI file that is that laugh. Okay. What about the man eater? We're almost done with Demon Souls. Oh, yeah, I remember this. <laughs> this sucked. Oh my god, are no Demon Souls bosses even remotely close? I don't think a single Demon Souls boss is gonna make it out of B. Okay. <laughs> don't you fight two of the- yeah, oh, yeah, 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 this is F. Yeah, this is like, it's absolutely F. You fight two of these. It's stupid. Alright, I think I can put these out. Uh, Maneater is F. Fool's Idol is like D. Man, this looks bad. I don't remember these two. Maybe I'll refresh my memory later. Am I happy with this? No, I'm not. Because Godric was definitely way cooler than the Flame Lurker. I gotta get Demon Souls in the right place. Is Gwyn better than Flame Lurker? Gwyn? The Gwyn fight kind of sucks, though. It's... I'm only doing it because I say, come on, Gwyn. Like, all the time. Like, seven years later. Right, is, is Ibritas better than Gwyn? Yes. Is Old Knight Alant better than Gwyn? They're kind of the same thing for me. They're like in the same spot. They feel very close in my brain. I think this is good for me. Ibritas is cooler than Flame Lurker. Was the Tibia Mariner cooler than the Monk? I don't want recency bias to ruin this list. No, I don't think so. Our Knight. Probably cooler than Tibia Mariner. Old Hero, probably cooler than Tibia Mariner. Penetrator, definitely not. Theric Beast... Better than Penetrator. Armor Spider is bad. Okay, I think I'm, I'm okay with this so far. Godric is at least a low A. I'm thinking about it.
I don't. I think Gascoin was cooler than Godric. At least for now. Give us the list. I, I put. It, I already put it in chat. It's already there. I already put it there. Am I too much of a big head? Should I have like more space like here? What do you guys think? Right. Like I'm just kind of like a big floating head. Yeah, that's like better. I'm like a person here now. I'm not just like. Okay, that's better. All right. Ornstein and Smaw. Um, am I happy with this? With where? For now, I am. Better chaos, worst. Dragon God's probably low as well, but the but he was cool looking. Vanguard Demon is better than that. <laughs> the D, D and F is just all Demon Souls fights. I kind of feel bad, but unless something changes, I think that this is correct. Definitely cooler than the Flame Lurker. Not cooler than Ebrutas, in a way. Alright, now we're in the Dark Souls 1 stuff. If I need some refreshers, I have them, but I do remember most of these. Moonlight Butterfly. Was pretty cool. But was it cooler than the Tibia Mariner? I don't know. They're kind of the same fight. Let's get the Taurus Demon out of the way because it's just going to be down here. Alright, Taurus Demon is probably... They're the same exact fight, so why not just put them in the same place? Sif was cool. I think Sif might have to be up in A. For now. Or maybe high B. I don't want to go too high with Sif. Wait, the Tor- no, 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 no. The Tor- the Asylum Demon and Vanguard Demon are the same. Not the Tor- the Taurus Demon is the one on the bridge. Which, that was okay. Again, these two are just in the same exact category for me. You're both on a bridge and you're both huge. And you're both too big for the bridge. Uh, this is the Scorpion Chaos Witch, right? The Scorpion Lady? That was alright. That didn't wow me, but it was okay. The Bell Gargoyles were like... Mm, they weren't great either. Capra Demon F. Even if that you beat that fight really easily, it's stupid. It's a terrible fight. Again... Let's make a room as big as an apartment bathroom, and you fight this fucking annoying thing in it. And there's two dogs here. It's awful. I actually liked Gaping Dragon. I like when he goes all the way forward. I don't know if it's A. Gaping Dragon was a, was cool. It was a weird boss and weird. It was a really weird fight. He hates all these bosses. No, I'm trying to be fair. This is the one that just spams down the hall, right? It's the fight is you just literally have to run down the hall with the magic, the caster. Yes, this is F. I think this is a high F, but it's F. Yeah, it's F. F is going to need a lot of moving around because I, I'm going to have to kind of go one by one. N Nito. Actually, let me get the other, because I have the Dark Souls 1 um, bosses too. Let me get those up. I remember Nito, Nito summons a bunch of shit, right? Where is it? Let's look at it. Nito was, was interesting, right? From what I remember. I'm going to need this for a few of these. Yeah, 
as the undead guy. You come in here and he summons a bunch of skeletons. And you have to run around in a circle and his... This guy actually has really annoying moves. Yeah, the skeletons just chase you down. This was horrible. He's also in the worst area in the game. I don't think this is F, though. I think the boss design is cool. I mean, it's a big thing of melded together skeletons and summoned skeletons. It, I think it was cool. I don't think it belongs below C. I don't know if it goes below uh, above B, though. Yeah, okay. I remember that one. The Four Kings. This is the one where it's just pitch black, right? This was all right. The design of the boss carries this one. The fight is F, but the design is like B. So I think it goes somewhere in the middle. Yeah, you could see that. This is stupid. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Fuck. All right, demon. F Is this the one where it has the stupid thing that you just walk into? For those of you that want to see the Capra demon and why I made it F, because this is the this is the Capra demon fight. It's so awful. You walk in the door, and immediately there's two dogs that attack you, and he's already right in front of you, and the boss room is this big. I actually might put this below Bed of Chaos. Just because of how truly dumb this thing was. Yeah, the Capper Demon takes three hits to kill. But there's nothing fun about this. Art equals bad. N I mean, no, but objectively speaking, this area is stupid. This boss is stupid. Look, the person even making the video on let me show you the bosses is having trouble with this. Because of how annoying this is. Yeah, even the guy in the video showing us this encounter is that He can't even do anything. <laughs> this is the way you felt you fight this piece of shit. He's gonna die. Yeah, you gotta let him. Fo that's a, that's what you do. Yeah. Okay. I, my opinion is validated for myself. Okay. Uh, the demon fire sage. This is the one that had the area was small, and you'd walk backwards and fall directly into the lava and die. Right? Because that was annoying. The fight's actually the fight. Yeah. 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 The fight's actually kind of fun though. I wouldn't say it's a bad fight. Demon Fire Sage? Where the fuck is this? Kind of like halfway through the game, right? El Gargoyles? Where is it? The right? Did I miss it again? How the fuck am I still doing this? Four Kings, Pinwheel, Cease. Is it not Ceaseless Discharge? No. Read video description for timestamps. But I mean, it's right here. It's right here. Like, how have I not seen it? This shit's not even here. I'm not gonna go look until I find it, because I feel like it's- I really don't think it's here. Stray demon? It's not- oh, there it is! Okay, yeah. Ceaseless Discharge is what I was thinking of. This is just an Asylum Demon that has fire. I'm gonna say pretty low. Uh, it's probably better- it, I would put it above. 
Asylum Demon, because at least it's a different thing. He's on fire. Yeah, okay. Uh, I need Centipede Demon, which is right here. I don't remember this one. I think a lot of the ones I don't remember, I blocked out of my memory because I might have hated them so much. This guy almost just died instantly. What the hell happened? <laughs> this guy's character looks like such a goofball. Yeah, I no, no, no. It's coming back to me. Because you you have to put you have to put a ring on, right? You need the lava ring, yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. Cool. Uh I remember Seath. Seath is design wise, I think, is at least A. There's such a weird just Kind of like gooey. This fight was not fun though. It was kind of sloppy. I love the way this dragon looks. What is eh. I don't think it's that bad. It's a cool fight. It's, well, the fight's not great, but it's not terrible. Okay, yeah, I say that goes somewhere and see. Alright. Stray Demon, this is the one that... After Stray Demon, we'll, play, we'll do some placement. Stray Demon's the one... Okay, I don't think I even need to look at Stray Demon. That's the one that you fall through the ground. And it's just an Asylum Demon, right? Hmm... The surprising factor makes this kind of cool, but the actual boss is just a, another Asylum Demon. With a couple extra attacks, yeah. Okay, I can do some placement. I think I got it. I got some placement here. Uh, Nito's going up to C. Four Kings or D. High D, though, for now. Centipede team, uh, D. Oh, do I even like these games? Demon Fire Sage was. Oh no, with Seath. Seath is like C. Trade Demon is like D. Demon Fire Sage was just. It's just a. It's just another demon. How come the Storm King is so low? I, I'm just trying to get things out. This is a very hard thing to do. Barely anything is above average right now. <laughs> I fucking hate from software games, apparently. I remember the DLC fights were... The, okay, this the night. I remember the night being really, really fun. The night was really cool, actually. I This is one of those fights that I remember was cool. Like, I've I actually really enjoyed it. Knight Autorius. Let me just, let me refresh my memory. This is the guy that uses one, the one hand to swing, right? The one-handed knight. Yeah, this was awesome. This is going at least a day. And you want to know why Gale is at S? Because this fight... Gale was just kind of a cooler version of this fight. Let 
me let me refresh my memory. All the cool swings with the one arm. Yeah, this fight was awesome. I mean, he's gonna kill it in like fucking five seconds, but you know, <laughs> it's like a thousand damage sorceries. This was really fun, though. I remember. This was a dance. This is one of those From Software fights where they got it really right because it really does feel like a fencing match between the two characters. That's why I like Horror Lou so much. That felt like I was fighting that boss. It was a back and forth dance. That's why Horror Lou might actually be number one. Okay, I know where that's going. That's going up pretty high. Sanctuary Guardian, I think I hated. Right? It was just like the this thing. Yeah, don't you fight two of them, too, at some point as well, and just annoying. <laughs> He's killing him so fast! <laughs> I just need refreshers. Okay. That one was alright. I remember being angry at the way you have to fight two, so that's kind of souring how I feel about fighting the one. Which I hope that doesn't happen with the Elden Ring bosses. Because needing to fight two of those Godskin Apostles was just... Uh, come on. Fighting two of this thing was always just annoying. And it might sour it. Alright, I'm just checking the rest of the DLC. We have Crossbreed Priscilla. Don't remember this. Oh, I do remember this. If thou seekest I, thine desires shall be requited not. This is the invisible fight. And it was awful. Yeah, you fight the invisible character. Yeah, look, come on. You don't even. Where is it? Wait, what? Wait, they just beat it in one hit? Alright, uh, we need the Dragon Calamit and then Manus and have an Iron. Oh, Iron Golem was alright. All right, what about the dragon, Calamite? Yeah, this was cool. You know what's gonna be really, really sad though for everyone that uh, this was a fun fight? Oh my goodness, does it even hold a candle to even one of the dragon fights in Elden Ring? How do you put this even close to Placidux? I don't know. That's gonna be hard. Then uh, let's round it out, Iron, uh, Iron Golem, just so I can make sure I know. Iron Golem was pretty early, right? so much better. Better than the overworld dragons. Yeah, that's true. But, mm, That first encounter with uh, Agil was ridiculous. Eh, it's just a kind of a tower knight, but maybe not as cool. Yeah, it's another one of those things where uh, fight me on a tiny area. Nah, yeah, this is a D, or like a like a high D. All right, it's time to place. I got enough info. Welcome back. 
Uh, this is... I mean, the fight is just... She, she's invisible. Or just, they're just invisible. That's how... Why they, how do you give that a good a high score? I don't think it's... Worse than the Four Kings. Sanctuary Guardian was cool. I'll get these right. The dragon, I'm gonna put in B for now, but just keep in mind that Ibritas is in B as well. B does not mean bad. Oh, the ceaseless discharge, the thing where you, yeah, this thing was like a C. That's where you fall back, yeah, fuck that thing. I didn't see Manus, did I? No. Did I see Manus? Oh yeah, this thing was crazy. Yeah, this thing was actually really cool. It's just what all the Asylum Demons, like, wished they were as a fight. Mm-hmm. Yeah, this is least to be. Alright, Dark Souls 1 is a- uh, I, we're gonna take a minute here. Because I need to make sure these are in the right spot. I'm gonna put this at B for now. Dark Souls 2 is going to be as hard as Demon Souls because it's been a very long time since I played Dark Souls 2. I'm actually probably going to do that last. So, let's begin. Ornstein and Smog. Was Ar Artorius cooler than Sif? Was he more fun, more interesting? I don't know. Right, everybody, look, I know that From Software has put a, like, wolf or, like, an animal with, like, a sword in his mouth. I know they've done, like, the look, it's a wolf an enemy again, like, a, a thousand times. But in Dark Souls 1, that first, seeing that for the first time was really cool. I'm going to keep it there for now. Is Ibritas better than Artorias? God, I fucking love Bloodborne. I just do. I'm so biased. It's awful. I'm so biased. Because the music, Ibritas' music is so cool. That like... It's just such a... It's amazing. The music in Bloodborne makes these bosses better. That like... It felt like I was in a cosmic journey. It's going up here. This might change. Aping Dragon is probably not close to this. You should play it? Yeah! Yeah, that's a good idea. Yeah, let's play it. I don't know why I keep pressing that button. I'm an idiot. Here it comes. Turn it up. I'm going to put both headphones in this, because Ibrutas might go higher. Bloodborne's music is by far the best out of any of these games. Without a doubt. Wait for it.
Godric's music is good too. And you know what makes a good song for me? It's I figured it out. Any of the bosses that have like the Ludwig has it, Godric has it, Ibritas has it, they all have it. Not the chorus. Godric's music does this thing where it goes. Is it a violin? What's that instrument? If it has a violin, I like it. Okay, let's keep going. I think these are in the right spot. Gwyn is probably Flame Lurker and Gwyn are like this. Like these are all like the same fight. It doesn't really matter. This is cooler. This is cooler. This is cooler than Flame Lurker. Ornstein and Smog was probably, uh, yeah. Slave Knight Gale's music was amazing. Oh yeah, it was. Ludwig's music is the best, without a doubt. Nothing compares. What about Madeir? All right, let's get this right. That looks good. That looks good. That looks good. Gaping Dragon is in a good spot. I think the Gaping Gwyn's probably the Gaping Dragon. I don't know. It's so hard to tell. I just uh, I think Ebertas was cooler than Sif. I do. All right. Let's go down here. Four Kings is better than this. I'm gonna put this pretty low. I so badly want to put the armor spider lower, but I don't think I can. This is fucked. I almost feel like somebody needs to level up here. I don't know which one's going to level up. These are all the same. Centipede Demon, what's the worst out of all of these? Probably these, right? The Adjuncticator is so bad. It's going down here too. I just got a baby formula ad? I, I don't know how you fucking got that. Was the Penetrator that bad of a fight? Or was it just kind of like, hmm? I feel like it doesn't belong down there. It was a regular enemy. I think it should be. I mean, it was still. It's it's it's, it's cooler than the Four Kings. The Four Kings is just a pitch black room, and they teleport next to you. I'm alright. I'm alright. I'm okay with this for now. Now for Bloodborne, I am not going to need to do any, I don't need to refresh at, at all for Bloodborne. I know all these by heart. Maybe some of them I might want to just take a quick look at. So we're going to skip Dark Souls 2 for now. Because Dark Souls 2, I, it's, it's gonna, that's going to take us the longest time, I think. You should show us some. All right. Yeah, our memory. Yeah, you know, it's, it's better that way. It's more fun. So let's open up... Um, Let's get Bloodborne up here, because Dark Souls 1 is complete. Nobody from Dark Souls 1 got to S. Bloodborne, Dark Souls 3, and Elden Ring all have a representative up here at S. Dark Souls 1 does not. Is that fair? I think so. I think so. Okay. Uh, Bloodborne time. So if you remember from Bloodborne, Cleric Beast is already up there. Let's see. Eh, I put... Eh, I think that that's fine where, that, where it is. So, we've got the one reborn, which I believe this fight was... didn't. I wasn't a big fan of it, but let's, let's refresh our memory. This is the big, like, blob enemy, right? Yeah, this is just a huge blob. This thing was annoying.
This is probably going to be one of the lower ones. Okay, let's put it up here. I don't know where Rom's going to go. Rom's area and Rom's, like, scariness was, was there, but nothing else for me. Yeah, this fight was... Uh, I didn't like this. I actually didn't really like this area that much either. Did the thing just swing? It, all of its extremities were just always attacking and... It was no opportunity to do anything. It just spit a bunch of... Yeah, this thing was... Just, yeah, this is one of the worst bosses in the game. Yeah, F? Yeah, I agree. I agree. Oh, no. F for frames. Oh, come on. Really? I was just going so good for a while. Why does Twitch hate my connection? Why, Twitch, why do you hate my connection? What did I do? Write it out for a sec. We alright? I think we're okay. I wish I had a solution. If I open do if I do a speed test right now, it'll be perfect. I don't get it. What? Why is everybody Omega lulling? What? Why is everybody why was there so many Omega lulls? There was a lot. Is it the bit right? No, it's not the, the bit. It's it, it just I'm losing packets to Twitch. The only service it's happening to. I think it's okay. Mm -hmm. All right, yeah, the, uh, but I do agree with you though. I think the one reborn should be F, if not very close. I'll put it at low D for now. Uh, I gotta, the music's gotta change as well here. Cause that was cool for a little bit, but let's get that off. Something else. What's up, anything else you guys wanna put up? Any songs? Why is everybody saying Omega Lull? Firelink Shrine? Yeah. We'll do some Elden Ring as well. Okay, let's put that down. One, let's let's do some more refreshing, please. I'd like if we could do some more refreshing. All right, that's the one reborn. Awful. Um, let's do. You already know these ones. Blood Star Beast was at was not a flashy fight. But it was interesting, at least. It was hard. You could make this fight really trivial if you have an item. And then the fight is essentially a free boss kill. You're making shit up? What? I'm not making shit up. You throw one of those skulls into the wall, and the Blood Star Beast just goes and attacks it, and you just get like a thousand damage for free. Five thousand. All right, what about some other ones I need? I I liked Vicar Amelia's fight. This was really cool. Nobody tell him what? What happened? Why are you guys doing this to me? What's going on? 
I don't know. I don't know. Are they just trolling? Yeah, this fight was really, really intense. It was scary, too. The Witches of uh, Hemwick, this is F. It's one of those, just, there's a four or five of them just standing in corners, just killed them. Yeah, this fight was awful. Mm-hmm. Okay, let me, wait. What else do we need a refresher on? Shadows of Yarnum, this fight was another, just three enemies in the same room. I, there were the snakes though, right? This was actually pretty cool. I don't know if this is going higher than like a B or a C. But I think it belongs somewhere. It was easy. I don't remember this being that easy. I thought this was kind of a pain in the ass. Yeah, they turn it. Well, the, they turned into a snake. That was really cool. Did they show that part? Yeah. Right there. I, I this fight's cool. I like it. Who else do we need? Rom was all right. Rom was cool because of the area. The fight was stupid. Okay. Rom did this really annoying thing where if if Rom rolled, it did this kind of roll roll move where he would spin around, uh, and it killed you in one hit. It was stupid. Okay. This fight was kind of disappointing. The yeah, amygdala fight. This was a disappointment for me. I remember these are the things, like, you're so scared of these things the entire game. And it's just kind of a boring fight. It just shoots lasers. This fight wasn't as scary as the enemy was hanging around. Does it have the laser move? Maybe that'll help. Hmm. Eh. Eh. Is all right. You know that one. This is the electricity monster. Which yeah, I'll give you a refresher. By the way, if you haven't played any of these games, you probably shouldn't be watching this stream because you're just getting spoiled in every single enemy. This was okay too. I wouldn't put it very high. But cool. Okay. Artyr Logarius. Oh, this is the old guy, right. This, I actually liked this fight. Yep, I actually liked this one a lot. He was cool. You cried here? I didn't stream Bloodborne. I played it on my own. This is before I was a streamer. It was a camera fight. Yeah, he was rough, but I still feel like he was fun to play against. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna turn <laughs> let, oh, let me turn off the fucking... I feel like I am idling right now in Dark Souls. I'm just sitting at the bonfire at the Firelink Shrine, and it's driving me fucking crazy. I feel like I want to alt-tab and close the game. Uh, we don't need a soundtrack for right now. We're good. We can change it when we need to. Okay, let's keep going. Alright, well, we have our audio right here. Celestial Emissary? This is bad. Fuck, man. Is there a lot of Bloodborne bosses that are, like, D? I... 
I might surprise myself a lot because this is this is absolutely like it at D or lower. If you guys see me put the deacons higher than this, if they're not on the same line, this whole list is wrong. Yeah, okay, that, yeah. Uh, there's Ibri Toss, by the way. If you're wondering why I like it so much, the thing is just so crazy looking and so cool. Look at this thing. It's so crazy. Crazy! And it makes it goes like Okay. Yeah. Wait. Hold on. Here comes the music. I want to hear the music one more time. Here it comes. Come on. Here it comes. Don't kill the boss before we hear it. Come on. I This game ran like shit. Yeah, it did. It's not even gonna play the music. Fucking whatever. Mikalash, this fight was an F, but his funny voice lines make it like a C. You chase him around this mist area, and he like goes like, oh, ha, 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 ha. Yeah, this was- I hated this. Those of you who are asking if this changes, no. This is the whole fight. You just follow this guy around a maze. And he laughs at you and says, yeah, this fight is like a D. You can't put this higher than C because this is- this is the fight. You're watching the whole thing. You just run behind this guy like a fucking recess. It's like, you're like- like tag. And sometimes shit just gets in the way. Yeah. No. Look at how long this one is. The longest one. Ooh. Murgo's Wet Nurse was cool because the music was creepy. I liked it. That fight is F. Stop the Bloodborne bias. That's true. This thing was creepy. I liked it. Okay, yeah, I know where that goes. Undead Giant? What is this fight? I didn't do this one. Merciless Chieftain? Who is Merciless Chieftain? Ah, uh, these are from the Chalice Dungeons. Okay. I didn't do any of these. Watchdog of the Old Lords, another Chalice Dungeon. Yeah. Eh, yeah, I didn't play it. Yeah, I didn't do it. Eh, yeah. eh, yeah. eh, yeah. eh, yeah. eh, eh. Nope. 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 No? I skipped over the Chalice Dungeon stuff. It's kind of funny, they turned... They turned the Chalice Dungeons into the dungeons in Blood, uh, Elden Ring. Very similar. Almost the exact same setup. So, that's pretty cool. Wow, I skipped almost all of this. All right. Okay. It's time for you to see the... It's time for you to see. <laughs> this is the best boss that From Software has ever made. 
without a single doubt. By far. Bloodborne also has the best DLC of any of the games as well. Actual fake fan? I did some of them, I just don't remember them. So you fight, yeah, well, well, remember this boss is fucking dumb. Boy, it's just like, it's, you've given this, uh, in Dark Souls 1, bosses like this, in Demon Souls, bosses like this, you gave this, like, a, a B, like a C or a D. I'm sorry. You're gonna have to, you're gonna have to wait a second. You're gonna have to wait a second. Okay, now we'll watch. Turn it up. Wow, you're fighting this like beast and he's scary and he's fucked up. Pretty cool. What's happening? What's going on here? <laughs> Shh. Quiet, we're watching. happening. <laughs> there he is. Now the real fight begins. Bat chest, what? You guys are all haters, and that's fine. That's fine. You can be a hater. That's the best. This is the best encounter that From Software has ever made, and I'm going to tell you, Horalu is close. It's going to be... I'm going to need some Jeopardy music, because I don't know. That's the coolest fight in the fucking entire game. Not only in the whole game, in the whole franchises that they've ever had. Bat chest. Now, I'll tell you, immediately following this boss is one of the worst bosses that they put in the DLC. Sorry, I just hopefully I didn't hurt your ears. Uh, Lawrence is just Cleric Piece on fire. We've seen them use this technique before. And this fight was dumb. It's just Cleric Beast that is on fire. <laughs> We've seen them do this a few times. There's a, there's a Ludwig Funko Pop. And I, you know, that sound... Uh, this is the, uh, this is the kind of overdone. Living failures, this is bad too. This is the same fight from the, yeah, this is really bad too. I heckin' love Lud- yeah, I heckin' love Ludwig. That's fine. This was so bad. <laughs> It's so unfortunate because this area is one of the coolest DLC areas of any From Software game. But the boss at the end of it is dog shit. Now we're getting into the real shit here. Hard equals bad? No, just putting like... Just small enemies that just spawn over and over again. You have to, no, I don't know. I don't want to chase around just enemies and kill them. Like deacons. I don't like the Deacon fight either. I thought it was horrible. Yeah, this fight was crazy as well. 
Not only that, this was a, I believe, a three-phase fight. Lady Maria was... I'm gonna say it. Probably the... Mm. Did you just say call... Did you say bootleg millennia? No, I'm sorry. This is actually a good encounter. This is actually a really cool encounter and a really fun encounter. This is high up there. The only reason why I don't know if I want to put this at S is because the... It, it's just a long fight and the second and uh, the, the second phase and third phase, whatever. Um, it just takes a long time to get there. It's Millennia with a gun. No, it is not. It's not bootleg Millennia. Maria came first. Don't you understand? Check this out. Oh, no, no, no. Now you fucked up. Now you got to phase three. What makes Millennia bad, other than that she's hard? The waterfall dance is the stupidest move in any game they've ever made. Just dodge it? I don't care. I don't care. I don't like it. Yeah, this is- now this is a fight, if I've ever seen one. Alright, we all know where that is. Orph- oh yeah, Orphan. Orphan's design is- I don't know, he kind of looks like one of the nobles in Elden Ring, with like a, a big sack. This fight was so hard, but he just screams. Yeah, he just loves cartoons like Tom and Jerry screams. I'm gonna put it at B. I don't think it's S. Sounds like you? <laughs> no, it doesn't. I'm not going to do this great. All right, we know where this is. Oh, these are huge, like spoilers, guys. Like, if you haven't played these games, just what are you doing here? Garriman's fight is awesome. In fact, Garman might actually be us. A horrible dream. Garman, I think, actually is us. This fight felt. I remember. I remember when doing this, and being like, "Yo, this is really. This is really happening right now." It was just like, "Holy shit! I'm playing. I am playing Bloodborne right now. This is happening." Yeah, this was so cool. And then when he goes, I mean, this is, my bit rate's probably awful right now. But with the scythe, he's, he's got the gun. Play the cutscene? I don't want to spoil the whole game. There's tons of people that didn't play this. It's only on PS4. What a shame. Okay, so this is the ma actual major spoiler coming up. I mean, like, absolute true major spoiler. This is, like, literally the final end of the whole game. Like, just to let you know. Um, the moon presence. Which I thought was alright. I didn't love it.
I can't say I particularly enjoyed this that much. Cooler than uh, Ludwig? No, I don't think so. That's ultra mid mega C. Yeah. It's a lot. It's a lot of this. It's a big dash that Moon Presence does. That's really annoying. It's not Garmin. All right, I think I'm ready. I believe I'm ready to do to place all the Bloodborne characters. Some of these are going to shock you. Some of these are going to shock you. Blood Starved Beast. Is a C. Blood Star Beast is better than Tibia Mariner. I don't think it's better than the old hero. Or uh, Nito. Nito is the kind of uh, C plus for me. Uh, Mikalash, host of the nightmare. This is D. I mean, it's F. So let's go ahead and put it there. The way that we're, we're we got to do this for real. Character's cool. The fight is just annoying. It's, it's voice lines are cool, but I'll if look, is it better than the one reborn? I don't think it is. It's is it better than Pinwheel? Pinwheel actually probably should be here. It's better than Pinwheel. Is it though? Because at least with Pinwheel, you get Pinwheel over with very quickly. Mikalash takes a long time. You just chase him around. You get it over with. Okay. Um, I cannot place Murgo's wet nurse yet. I can place Amygdala. This is a C. Uh, Martyr Ligarius is... I don't think it's A. I think it's B somewhere, but I'll get it right. Airman is A. I don't know if... It, let me get it in the right spot before anybody freaks out. Moon Presence Super Ultra Omega C. Living Failures, F. Are they better than, uh, no. The Witches of Hemwick, this is a D. Although it maybe should, I don't know. How many Bloodborne bosses are bad? All right, Lady Maria. Lady Maria is coming up to A. Um, Lawrence, high D. Where's Cleric Beast? They both, I mean, they're both the same exact thing. They're fine. Orphan. I don't know, I'm going to be honest with you. The, the, the final boss of Bloodborne being just kind of like a naked guy screaming. It was like, it was, I, I get it. I understand, like, the lore. I understand. I get it. But I don't think it was, I don't think so. I have to consciously put this higher than in the Flame Lurk, than Gwyn. I mean, it was it, it probably what Gwyn maybe shouldn't be this high. It's not, it's not better than Ligarius. I had more fun with Ligarius. I'll, I'm gonna keep it there for now. Anything that's high. Rom, C. All right, Vicar Amelia. I'm going to say B. Celestial Emissary, somewhere down in F or D, whatever. It's just, it was, it, the, no. Virgo's Wet Nurse, is gonna, I'm going to go uh, low B for now. Arl, C. Shadows of Yarnum. 
I see. I did not do these ones, so we're going to put them here. I know, dude, your favorite game, your favorite game is Bloodborne, and you have not done any of these. No. I didn't. None of them. Nope. No. Nope. Okay. That's my that's my favorite game ever made. And I didn't be I didn't do any of these. They were hidden deep in all these chalice dungeons. I just, I was, I didn't really like the chalice dungeons. Okay. We are, we are getting there. We're getting there. I, let's go ahead and get these out of the way. Because I, all the Elden Ring ones are, are in memory. So let's get the Bloodborne stuff in the right place. And then we'll do Elden Ring. All right, Father Gascoigne, A+. Plus. Godric, yep. Maria, I think that's fine where it is. Although I think they're better than these. I got to knock down Sif a little bit here. Orphan. Ligarius was cooler than all these. What a great game. Uh, all right, so Logarius better than Ornstein and Smog. Koss was, I mean, Old King, I mean, I don't know. Gaping Dragon better than that. Flame Lurker. Did you play the game? It's one of my favorite games of all time. Well, I didn't do the extra side dungeons. That doesn't matter. Oh, guess what? I think Super Mario 64 is one of my favorite games. I didn't I didn't ever get 120 stars. I got like 80. Do I need to get everything? You missed half the bosses. I didn't miss half the bosses. All right. I think this is fine where it is. I actually don't think this is better than this. I think Gascoigne was better than Garamond because I I don't know. I, I thought Gascoigne is like one of my favorite characters in that game. You're a fraud. I didn't do any of this. The Chalice Dungeons were confusing. I just played the game. I beat this game. Okay. I beat Bloodborne, God, like probably 10 times, and I never did any of the Chalice Dungeons. I, I they, they were annoying. It was like, I, they were all the same. They were all the same dungeon, just randomized, and I don't know, I didn't like it. I didn't want to do it. But it's fine. Okay. Moon, okay. Shadows of Yarnum. The Wet Nurse. I think this is fine up here. Blood Starved Beast. Definitely not cooler than the Tibia Mariner. Or definitely better than the Bell Gargoyles, because like those things are stupid. Forest Demon as well. A lot of C's all in a row here. I think Amygdala is better than... I don't think it's cooler than Seath. At least Seath looked kind of weird. Moon Presence was probably better than this. Yeah, these all have to come up. Like, Penetrator is just a guy with a sword. This is not like a huge deal. Hmm. These are F. Yep. 
Mikolash is probably the worst of the four. Just because I just chasing him around was annoying. Why the fuck is the Tibia Mariner above the Moon Presence? I'm working on this, okay? This is- I'm working on it. <laughs> I need to make sure. There's a lot of creatures here. The Tibia Mariner is cooler. I think so. I think the Tibia Mariner is cooler than the Moonlight Butterfly. The Moon Presence is just... Yeah, the Moon Presence is cooler than the... Yeah, that's true. Yeah. I don't think... I think this is the wall. This is the wall. To graduate to C+, you have to be cooler than the Tibia Mariner, which is, it seems like apparently a pretty big feat. This is the wall. You have to be cooler than the Tibia Mariner. Or else, excuse me. This is not... You're not getting the exclusive C++ club. Is the Moon Presence cooler than the Tibia Mariner? Fight-wise, mechanics-wise, looks-wise. No. Are any of these motherfuckers cooler than the Tibia Mariner? Shit, somebody might be. Hold on. I gotta make sure I get this right. Vrom might be cooler than the Tibia Mariner. Do you know what I mean? I think we, uh, I think Rom graduates. Quaylag might be cooler than the Tibia Mariner. Absolutely no way the Taurus Demon, Bell Gargoyle, Butterfly, Seath is definitely cooler than all these though. All right. Very important. Is Seath the Scaleless cooler than the Tibia Mariner? Yes. All right. I think we're good. One reborn at least is a fight. This is going up here, Pat. I mean, the, this is just... For stuff that I don't want to put in F because I don't want to have F be crowded. Because I want to at least pretend like I like these games. So, I can't just put all these things in F. I don't think this belongs down here. This is definitely cooler than this. Capra D. What's the worst thing? Dirty Colossus is not the worst thing. Better Chaos is probably the worst. And I gotta be honest, so is the, the Celestial Emissary is not even a boss fight. You fight like three dozen of those little like bug alien people. And then it ends. This actually could be the worst. Dirty Colossus is just, it's not bad, it's just boring. Living Failures belongs down here too. I didn't like these at all, they were terrible. I'm trying to get it right. Capra Demon is probably the coolest out of all of these. I think this is accurate. I think I got it. Dirty Colossus should be a no, not F, right? If I'm going to put Dirty Colossus in F, then all the Asylum Demons have to be in F. Same thing with the Maneater. Dirty Colossus is going up and so is Maneater. And we're going to bring all these Asylum Demons down. This is looking a lot better. Way better than it was before.
Centipede Demon is, is definitely cooler than this. Just put the two bugs next to each other. Who cares? Iron Golem's going down here, too. Feels like, who, who cares? You're at least a fight. This goes here. You're at least a fight. You go there. This is a this is hard. I think I'm I'm good for Bloodborne. I don't know if I want to put any of these at S. I have to reliably say that was one of the coolest. Like that was awesome. That was unbelievable. Hmm. I'm going to leave it for now. I think I like Godric more than Maria. I like Godric more than Gascoin. Oh shit, no I don't. That's recency bias. Alright, let's do Elden Ring. Because I can do these quick. Elden Ring, I can do it really quick. Here we go. Uh, Mog. We just did it. I don't need any refreshers. Mog is going to be up at, um, C. Or B. For now. Probably here. Wait, is Mog cooler than the Tibia Mariner? Yes, absolutely. Mimic tier, uh, it's a comedy boss, so it's just going in D. I don't think it's F. It's, I mean, it's close. Also, oh, Rykard. Okay, Rykard was a gimmick fight, but was a really cool design boss. It's going to go B. We need some music or something. Uh, yeah, we'll put something on. See, I'm just getting him in the general area. Uh, this is not... Uh, we're not done completely. Hold on. It's got to be. It's got to be in a general, the general area. I can hear myself breathing. I'm working on it. How about um, it's a good OST. Bug snacks? No, it doesn't fit. Mario sixty four. Yeah, sure. No, that doesn't fit either. That's gonna annoy me. I know it will. Um, Halo? Hmm. Hmm, Hollow Knight. Yeah, that sounds fine. Okay. Because I'm not gonna, I'm not, we're not watching any Elden Ring stuff. There you go. Now we can not freak out. So, uh, Godskin Noble, that's the fat one, right? Or is that the skinny one? Fat? I actually like that a lot. That was a cool fight. But, they, I don't know, I kind of, they used it too much. Don't you feel like it was kind of used a little too much? I'm going to put it down to C, just because I feel like they used this too much. This character appears in the game like four times. Three times? Yeah, but I mean, it's like, I don't know. I feel like there was too many places. I'm going to keep it here for now. Um... Actually, I could probably do some of the Sekiro ones too, off of memory. All right, we got uh, Elder Dragon Grail. This is the one that you just put a bleed weapon on and kill it, right? It doesn't really attack back. I mean, is this really a boss? Or is this just kind of like a, a set piece that dies? Uh, yeah. Yeah, it's F. F, but no, I don't think it deserves to be an F. For Dan? F? 
Uh, Regal Ancestor Spirit. I like that a lot. That was a lot of fun. It's going to be for now. Uh, we've got the Gargoyles. Which I feel like I would have been kind of... I'm going to make a statement here. All the... It's two enemies in the same room, boss. There, those are all at least a C or lower. They just are. Like, we just put two in the room. Eh. Uh, Dragonkin Soldier of Noxtella. Did I do this? Oh, and these are the Dragon Soldiers. They kind of overuse these two, but... They were interesting. See. Fia's champions. These were bad. Oh yeah, this is this is the Godfrey Shade. Which is probably somewhere in the high sea. Maybe not. I gotta I'm gonna that's gonna take a lot of looking. Okay, Astel, Natural Born of the Void. This I liked this one a lot. Astel's going up to at least high B. We'll we'll sort it. We'll sort it. Some of these have to get you have to graduate these to A. You don't just put it in A. Unless you're certain. Margit. Margit and Morgoth are gonna be next to each other, because they're the same person. If one fights is a lot harder. Margit. It wasn't that. It was alright. It was okay. I think it's like a B. And Morgoth. It's kind of unfortunate. I'm gonna have to put this down here. Uh, Morgoth goes down and I don't know because I didn't kill him. I summoned the Mimic tier before the nerf and it killed him in less than 15 seconds. I don't even know what that guy does. I, I have no idea what Morgoth's moves are. Um, the Mimic tier killed him in 10 seconds. And it was at that moment that I said, I'm not going to use the Mimic tier again, unless I need to. Um, I got one attempt in, but I, I, I didn't really even fight this boss. Commander Nile. Commander Nile was the one with the summons, with the electronic uh, lightning prosthetic, right? Mm, I don't know. If Cool than Margaret? Maybe. But the, the Ancestral Spirit I thought was a really cool fight. It's, it'll be here for now. Why is Redan so low? I hated that fight. It was stupid. I don't like it. I don't like it at all. It, it was one of the worst. This one was cool too, but then they started using this as a regular enemy and it kind of took the magic away from me. But I would say at least like a... B minus. Bori. Okay, these are dragons. We'll leave the dragons for now. Fire giant. I would have loved to have been able to see the fire giant, but it actually was a pretty cool fight. Especially the cutscene and then the second phase. It's going to stay here for now. Hard equals bad. When, where? When did I say that? What are you talking about? All right, which one of these down here? is hard. Let me tell you. This fight, you can kill in one hit if you really want to. This is not hard. This is not hard. This is a gimmick. 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 These are tutorial fights. And this is a gimmick. Oh, are these hard? Are you talking specifically Rodan? Rudan is staying at F. Rudan, it's not a hard fight. It's a dumb fight. And that was pre-nerf, which was even worse. And let's make everybody angry just because they'll get it out of the way. Um, Mog, Lord of Blood. Wait, didn't I already put Mog? Was Mog. Is 
Did I put Mog? Mog the Omen. Mog... Alright, well, whatever. It's the, the same thing. You never fought the other one. Oh, whatever. Uh, it's just in the same place, then. Gold skin duo. Uh, I mean, I'm, I, it's alright. C minus. Dragon Lord Placida 6. Dragon Lord Placida 6 is, uh, is very high. I think we've got our first uh, A, at least. Uh, besides Godric. Yeah. Dragon Lord and Godric are pretty close. I think Dragon Lord's cooler, though. Dragon Lord's cooler than Gascoin. I have to be fair. Ranala, Ranala was and like C, C plus maybe. Better than that. Hmm. It was a, it was just kind of the magic spam fight, right? All right, Malaketh. Malaketh was not. I don't know. I feel like, did I have a lot of complaints about, uh, about Malekith? I think I did. I love that clergyman, though. I love that beast clergyman. Really cool design. We're going to use that part. Design-wise, really cool. I think it's a good spot for it for now. Oh, Gideon. <laughs> oh, the all-knowing, of course. Hmm. D. Maybe D plus. That's better than the four kings. Uh, Leon Misbegotten. These are the kind of lion wolf people with the sword. They weren't bad. They were. I mean, they were. They were used a lot. Kind of like I would put it in the same categories. I'm gonna put high C, low B. The bosses that they just kind of made regular enemies, like, five times. I think these- that is fair. These might come down. Gideon deserves better. We'll see. Hold on. It's about comparing to the other games. Uh, Loretta? This is gonna surprise a lot of you guys. I may have just uh, gotten like 10 unsubscriptions in a row. I really liked that fight. I thought it was really cool. That fight didn't feel annoying. It was kind of challenging. The dodging the magic and the spear with the horse. You can't get on the horse. I liked it a lot. What music is playing? Don't tell me what this is. I forgot what the OST is. Don't tell me. Hollow Knight. Okay. Um, now we got... Ancient Hero of Zamor. Oh, some of these are the, are the jail. Death Bird. Oh, yeah, the, that, I remember that. I hated that. Soldier of Godric? Just a regular enemy? Why is it Soldier of Godric? Deathbird, uh With the death magic on the ground. This is a D. Melania. Blade of Mikola. Worse than Soldier of Godric. Radagon and Elden Beast together. This is a this is a mid C. Give you my reasoning. 
but oh, stream is dying again. Oh, interesting. Very interesting. I don't get it. That makes sense. Like, um, I don't get it. My internet's fine. Why? So as I was saying, Lin oh my God. I, like, I just like almost swallowed it and like choked. Melania is F. This reminds me of the Cox days. Here's the thing though. If I run a speed test right now, it'll be 1,000, 1,000. I could go watch like a 4K movie while the stream is dying. It's not my internet. It's not. It's not the internet. It's some co the connection that this internet, but I have two Twitch's servers. Sometimes it just gets fucked. It just gets fucked up. While that was happening, I I did a test. While that was happening, not a single solitary problem. When it was happening during the Fortnite tournament thing, I was in the call, and they were. Yeah, I had green bars on Discord. Everything was normal. I don't get it. it doesn't make any sense. Speed test does not equal stability. Well, what? Why? Then I would. I should have dropped out of the Discord call. I looked over here and I went. I went to zero a couple times during that Fortnite tournament, and it was green bar, perfect connection on Discord and to Fortnite. I didn't get kicked out of Fortnite. I was in it the whole time. You know what I mean? A routing issue between the ISP and Twitch. It has to be. There's nothing. There's like nothing I can really do. The only thing I can do is I can contact Twitch, and just be like, "Yo, um, what's happening? Like, how? What? What? Can you look at my connection and see like what's going on?" Because on my end, nothing is wrong. And, but, but before, when I used to have internet problems all the time, that was a me problem. That was like, I was dropping packets. My internet browser wouldn't even open. A speed test would be like 0.5 up and like 0.2 down. So, it's not this time. It's not the internet this time. It's, some, it's something to do with the routing to Twitch. Who knows? Anyways, that was... Uh, uh, I don't think Millennia, obviously, let's be, I'll be fair. Millennia, I think, was somewhere up here. Hard equals bad. Yes, hard equals bad. All right. Some of these were just kind of the little mini bosses, which I don't know if they should be on here. Magma Worm was kind of cool. I actually liked that fight.
I'll stick with this for now. For now. Ancestor Spirit and Regal Ancestor Spirit. I'm going to put the same spot. Because it's kind of the same fight, but the Regal one was upgraded a little bit. Where is it? Right here. Okay. Ulcerated Tree Spirit. They used this a lot. It was cool the first few times. It's not going to be F. It's going to be like C. Somewhere around with the Dragonkin there. Regal had the big heal. That was fine. You should put Redan higher. I probably will. All right. The, the Tree Sentinel was... I know they did it a few times, right? But... That fight was really cool because at the first time you see the Tree Sentinel, it's almost like, holy shit, there's a boss right there. And that's the first time you have to do any horseback fighting if you wanted to, and it was really intense. I like it there for now. We'll see in a minute. Patches. Eh. I wouldn't really call this a boss fight as much as an NPC encounter, but whatever. I'm going to make a new category here for mini bosses. I don't think it should be on here. I'm going to make category for mini bosses. And that's its own uh it's its own category. Yeah, that's a good idea. Mini boss. That's better. Okay. So, mini bosses cuz these are going to just it's going to get all gummed up. It is. This is, doesn't belong here, right? This, this is going to get all gummed up. And I don't want it to. Tree Spirit. That was a mini boss. Technically, it's going to get all gummed up. Who else is a mini boss? Tibia Mariner belongs down there. Tibia Mariner, I don't think, deserves to be down there. Hmm. I mean, very clearly, we know what a mini boss is, right? Like the Crystallian, that's a mini boss. I'm just gonna get him up here and I'll do it. Dragonkin Soldier is, is kind of a mini boss, wouldn't it? Yeah, the Ancient Hero of Zamor, I mean, that's a mini boss. There are like five Tibia Mariners, that's true. Putrid, oh, all yeah, all the tree avatars. Sa you okay? Do you really think that Sanguine Noble is a something should be up on the boss list? I don't think so. Ruin Bear is not a boss. It's a, uh, I know, I know that they show up everywhere. Royal Knight Loretta. This is the same fight, just a little bit different. I actually liked the first one more. I'm gonna put it up. Beasts of Farum Azula. Put that here, mini boss. All the all the dragons are mini bosses. They're going up in the same place. Crucible Knight, mini boss. Second one is way better. I like the first one better. I don't know why. Our Erdtree avatars times five. Times three, times two, times, yeah, times two. Crucible Knight, yeah. Great Worm. This is uh, technically a mini boss, right? Technically. 
Miranda the Blighted Bloom. I don't even know what this was. First of Night Duo? I don't even know what that is. Kindred of Rot Duo? Did I do those? I think so. Elber of the Briar? I don't know what that is. Fortisax is really cool. That's going up high on the mini-boss list. Wait! Is Fortisax a mini-boss? Kind of, right? No, it had its... No, 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 it wasn't. But I just was so over-leveled it felt like one. It was a really, really cool fight, though. I just killed it in, like, not even a minute. Oh, I remember Necromancer Garrus. The Red Wolf of the Champions. Yep. <clears throat> That's a mini boss. Spirit Caller Snail. Did I fight that? Mad Pumpkin Head. Nox Duo? I didn't do that. Nox Duo. Hesgar. Well, that's not the right game. Lean Rot Knight Duo? I don't think I did that either. The Demi Human Queen? Three of them. I think I did one of these? Thief of Fire? Did I do that? I don't remember. There's so many bosses, I don't remember. The Christ I remember the Crystalline Duo. I remember Worm Face. Worm Face was kind of a... Uh, was a real boss, though. Mm, not really. Not really. Did you even play Elden Ring? Dude, I I streamed all... Yes. Flying Dragon? Commander O'Neill. Didn't I already do this? Or is it a different, is it a different person? Featured avatars? Yeah, put them up there as well. It's going to be way too hard to put these anywhere remotely up with all the regular bosses in quotes, right? It just is. Battle Mage Hughes? Grafted Scion? I don't know. Did I fight this? You're not doing a tier list. You're doing a shitty From Software wiki? You have to put them up here. I gotta put them up here first. What do you mean? I, I, there are like 300 squares in this. This is not a wiki page that I've got. Uh, this is a list of my favorite bosses throughout the whole series. We haven't, I have to get them up here. There are 10 Knights Calvaries? Holy shit. Carrion Knight Bulls. Putrid Crystalline Trio. I didn't fight that. I did fight the Falling Star Beast. But not these ones. Did I? I... Where, where is it? Yes. Super Falling Star Beast, right? That's when I fought. Oh, is that, is that a mini boss? These are mini bosses? Sentinel Tree Bob? Grave Warden Flying Dragon? Alright, you know what? All the mini bosses are on the same fucking level. Okay? We're not. They're all on this. There's too many. And I didn't even do like a third of these. So, mini bosses are just whatever. I'm just delete it. Yeah, just get rid of it. Yeah, that, I just delete it. No. I, all the mini bosses, we're not even gonna put. This, just, who cares? No. The, all the mini bosses, they were cool, they were fun, but I don't need to place like three stone digger trolls. So. Who is a real boss that's still down here? None of them. They're all up there. All the dragons, I'd say, are up there with Godskin. 
Uh, too many. Very, I don't know. These are, these are all bitty bosses. Agent Dragon. Oh, this one, right? This is a boss. This is a real boss. This is the worst tier list. Dude, just give me a minute. I'm going to get... I'm going to put this shit where it goes. Be a mariner. Remove it. Uh, but that's our wall to determine is it, if somebody's cool or not. <laughs> Alright, there are four Tibia Mariners. I get it. But that's like the wall for is that is something cool. Fine, I need to have a new wall then. Fine. Fine, it's gone. Okay. We're good. All right. Taurus, put the Taurus demon up there as a wall. No, the Taurus demon sucks ass. No, that's not the wall of if you're cool. <laughs> the Taurus demon is stupid. All right. The wall for if you are cooler than a C. Shit, these gotta go. I gotta get rid of the mini boss. The, these are mini boss versions. You're working backwards. It's a. I got it. I'm gonna say Godfrey the First Elden Lord, the a lemonade version of him. Is I would say, what happened to my eye? Is a C. Straight up C. C. So, we have to do some work here. Deathbird, get out. Is Renala cooler than the Godfrey? Yeah. Is Tower Knight cooler than Godfrey? Radagon is definitely better. I just thought, I thought the Radagon right into the final boss, Elden Beast. Just, I don't know. I don't like that. I don't know. You're going backwards. I'm not going backwards! I'm okay with it being in a bit. Radagon's fight was really cool, and then they just like, alright, here, if I end the game now. The Elden Beast was alright. I don't think it's bad. I don't think it was great either, though. We're gonna start from the bottom. No Fs in Elden Ring? Oh yeah, there is. It's like two of the major characters. <laughs> oh my god. I will move Redan because Redan is better than the Asylum Demon, I guess. Not, I like Gideon more than Redan. He can stay there. Okay. We might see some S's from Sekiro. We're almost done. We just got Dark Souls 3 Sekiro and then uh, sprinkle in Dark Souls 2. We're good. This is almost done. Okay, let me get the Elden Ring done. Oralu. Slave Knight Gale. Was Haralu cooler than Slave Knight Gale? It's too recent, but I don't think so. 
It's tricky. I don't think so. I think that makes sense to me. And I think this makes sense to me as well. No, that's recency bias. Put it back. These are the same boss, but I'm going to keep this. I'll keep this one because that's like the oh, look. It's it's Loretta, right? This is kind of like this two versions of this boss. Okay. Uh, that's not fair. I like that. Uh, Ligarius is better than Malekith. I feel like Malekith's fight is not, doesn't, it takes, it's so quick. It's just a DPS burn fight. It's really cool, but, hmm, I don't know. I think some of these have to come back. Malekith needs more HP. How many humans do you sacrifice to look so young? Uh, zero. I have a skincare routine. I talked about it earlier during the Fortnite thing. Uh, moisturize your face. Moisturize your face. When you're out of the shower, get a nice, like, light moisturizer and just get it on there and rub it in. It takes 10 seconds. Please. I'm telling you. Do it. All right, Rykard was... Rykard is... Okay, Rykard and Gaping Dragon are similar. Fire Giant comes down. Is Malekith cooler than Astel? Probably, but no, but the fight doesn't last long enough. Calumet's probably not as cool, though. Garius is cool than all of them. No smoking and no drinking. I mean, I drink. I drink maybe, I don't know, once a month? Maybe five or six times a year, maybe? Maybe like ten times a year, maybe? I don't smoke. I don't really drink that often. I mean, I dabble in, um, I dabble in THC a little with CBD, but not, not you know, nothing crazy. I don't drink that much alcohol, though. All right, let's keep going. I actually don't think I have to move any of this. Maybe this. I'm trying. I wish I fought this at the right level. It would probably be way higher. That's cooler than the tree sentinel, like, let's be honest. Yeah. I like this. I think this is good. Shadows of Yarnum, cooler than Renala, yep. Godskin Noble needs to come down. What is old hero? The old hero and old punk. Okay, nobody move. Is Gideon cooler than Godfrey? What do you think? He m it might be. Mm, maybe. Okay, yeah, you know, you're right, you're right, you're right, right. Fia's champion belongs down here. I'm gonna put Melania behind the Mimic tier. I laughed out loud. No, I'm not. Fuck that fight. I was just doing that to make you happy. And this is my list. Sorry. I'm sorry. I think Elden Ring is good. Three A's from Elden Ring so far. Do they belong up there? And 1S, no representation at all from Dark Souls 1. Okay. You missed like 60 bosses. 
I think I'm okay with that. I think because there's a lot of B's and A's. Margit was... Yeah, the Ancestor Spirit I like more than some of these. Right there. Right there. Right here. Win come back. You were stupid. You were cool, but stupid. And you too. Okay. I like where they are. Alright. Looks good so far. Now... It's time. Remember, we're not doing mini bosses. So all these, these like uh, the Shinobi Hunter, uh, the Headless, the, we're not doing any of the mini bosses because that'd be way too hard. You should go to bed. This is not going to take that much longer. No, let's do Dark Souls. 3. I don't. Let's do Dark Souls Three. Yeah, Dark Souls Three is good. A good idea. Okay, Pontiff Sullivan. Pontiff Sullivan is going to be up here. Cooler than Ligarius, but I don't think cooler than Loretta. Maybe. I think so. Uh, the ones that I remember. Oh, I remember this this fight. I don't like it. This is like a D. This is the caster with a big tail. The devout. Yeah, didn't like that one very much. It was kind of like eh. Put that next to Gideon, I think. The fight was kind of ass. All right, gun deer. I'm gonna just put one gun deer, and I actually really like the gun deer fight, except for the phase two is kind of annoying, but I like the fight. Let's put... Where's Champion Gundyr? We'll leave Index down here, because it's literally the same thing. Oh, the Lothric Prince fight! That was awesome! Yep, that's going up to A. I liked that fight. Where he's riding on the, on the other one's back? we get a refresher? Yeah, we can do some refreshers. Turn the music off. Uh, why can I not turn it off? Okay. Uh, we'll do some refreshers on some of these. We don't need too much, though. Okay. So this is Index Gundir. Uh, Vort. I, remember, I don't think we need it. But all these... Uh, uh, the, Oh, no, 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 no. How do I get this one an F? Yeah, that's what are you doing? In a single video, that's right. Curse Rod of Greatwood is just the Erd Tree avatars, but way bigger and more annoying. You had to, like, pop the bubbles, right? Yeah, that one was okay. Crystal Sage was kind of rage-inducing. I know everyone thought that was one of the easiest bosses. It took me a long time. I remember if I, I remember dying like 20 times to this on stream. That was that annoying teleport and then bring every... You just clone yourself 10 times. The Abyss Watchers were cool. Probably B, I would say. That fight was pretty fun when they fight each other. And then it gets uh, all uh, smoky and fiery. Yeah, this was cool. I feel like a lot of the Dark Souls 3 bosses are going to be very high. That was kind of, that was kind of like the shine. I, I can't even speak. That was kind of the shining part of the game for Dark Souls 3 for me. It was uh, the bosses I thought were great. Deacons are going to be F. A uh, comedy F though, so it's not like I hate it. It's just the fight is not that great. Wool near. Oh yeah, this is the big guy with the hands. You have to hit the br the bracelet, right? This guy was cool. Fuck man, this is a good game. 
Old Demon King. I remember this one. What was this one? Oh, yeah. Am I... Do I have, like, rose-tinted glasses on, or is this game amazing? Pontiff? Yeah, we already know Pontiff. Aldrich. Yorm is probably a D. It's a gimmick fight. Yorm is just, uh, Rykard, but boring. This is the same exact fight. No difference at all. Okay. Dancer, the Boreal. Dancer was cool. I beat Dancer first try. Although, a little, a little spammy though. I'm not sure this is higher than like a, a B minus or a C. It was a little spammy. Dragon Slayer? Armor? D. This guy sucks. This is the guy that leaves the area and like shoots you with fucking shit from across the game. I hated this fight. This guy was annoying. And all that all that crap comes in just spamming at you. Yeah, this fight this guy's a D plus. This guy leaves and then yeah, he does. Watch, he leaves. He doesn't leave? Who's the boss that leaves the area and then spams shit at you? This guy does not do that. A butterfly? Okay, well... I love this. I love this fight. This is an old little ocelot. I will protect you. Is it A? He's holding what he thinks is like a baby or something? Yeah, this is a cool fight. This is a wild boss. This is at least A+. plus. This is terrifying. There's Champion Gundir. So I think this should be pretty high too. Damn. Am I being shown that I actually like Dark Souls 3 more than all of them? This is a, I think that's what's happening. This is the Lothric fight where he rides on his back. Yep, okay. I like that fight a lot. Ancient Wyvern. Oh, this is kind of a gimmick, right? Don't you just like jump on his head? Eh, like D. Well, let's just see it, right? Might as well. Yeah, you have to just run through this. I remember it was such a pain in the ass just to jump on him and kill him. Yeah. Nah. This is pretty low. Yeah, we don't need to see it. Nameless King. Uh, yeah, this is a great one. Riding the dragon. Yeah, this was insane. He gets off the dragon, and you're like, oh my god, I gotta fight them. I gotta fight this guy. Might as well just refresh, right? Just see if we can remember. This, yeah, this is awesome. This, yeah, this is probably S. This might be the S from Dark Souls 3. The music, too, was so crazy. Soul of Cinder. Oh, this is the last... But yeah, I, this guy was not... It was alright. I would say Nameless Kings... You should have just given Soul of Cinder Nameless Kings moveset. And encounter. I remember having fun fighting this, but I don't know if it's S. 
Okay. This is the DLC. This is the wolf and the grave guy, right? The grave tender. This looks like such shit. I think I got really mad at this one. Yeah, because the wolf could just sprint at you randomly and just he ran across the map like three times. This fight was just, I didn't like this. It was bad. It wasn't necessarily bad. It was just I don't know. It was just frustrating. This is the guy stuck in the chair. I remember laughing at this. So that's at least a B. Yeah, this is the guy that was stuck in the chair. Yeah, then he gets angry. And you fight them both at the same time. I don't think I beat this on stream without help. Do I remember that correctly? I think I got to a point where I was like, no, I don't care. Just come help me. This is a cool encounter, though. Let's just see the chair, because it's funny. <laughs> really cool, though. All right. Demon Prince and the two demons. The phase three is S tier. Did I do this? Demon in pain, demon from below. Did I do this? You did. Took me a lot of job. Oh, I did do this. Yeah, I remember the area. Spear of the church. It's a boss. Oh, this is the invasion one, the PvP one. Yeah, eh, it was alright, but whatever. Yeah. Half light. Yeah, the whole spear of the church thing was kind of. It was okay. It was a, it was an interesting encounter. That's what this is the one where it was actually like people could in, invaded you and tried to kill you, right? Which is really funny. And then uh, Madeira, which. I don't- we tried to Mario Party this boss, and I don't think we beat it. These- all these bosses are absolutely amazing, though. And then, who could forget this? Is already an S. Slave Night Gale already an S might be the best. This is another one of those fights that just felt like a dance. It was tough. It was really hard. It was fair. There was a lot of interesting things going on. Dark Souls 3 is too easy. Um, I don't think so. I thought Dark Souls 3 was actually really hard. This was so fun. I remember I didn't get mad. You know how you can tell when a boss is really, really good? When I don't get mad at it. At all. It's just like, wow, this is amazing. I can't wait to fight that again. All the things that are in S tier were that for me. You mean when it's easy? You. Well, Garman is not easy. 
Horolu is not easy. Ludwig is not easy either. You know how many times I died to the first phase of Ludwig? Or Horolu is easy. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is a great fight. This fight's not even easy. What are you talking about? Okay, it's time. What time is it? Oh god, it's getting late. How long have I been doing this for? Shit. Alright, let's do it. This is where they belong. Old Demon King. We'll see you up at, uh, we'll see you up at the, uh, B tier. B minus. Yorm the Giant. Hmm. Dancer, B. Maybe high C, low B. Here it is. Okay, this is the uh, Ocelot. This is A. I'm gonna have to move that around. Champion Gundir, high B. The reason why I wanna do this so bad is because I wanna see what game I actually liked the least. And here's the crazy thing. Dark Souls 1 looks like the game I fucking liked the absolute least. I came to watch the Fortnite VOD, but he's still streaming this stupid tier list. I I hate to break it to you, but there was probably like six minutes of Fortnite gameplay in three hours. We were looking at a spectator screen. If that's what you're here for, I'm sorry, that's not what that's not what you're gonna get. You came here for Fortnite. Like, I should just delete that VOD because it's literally like, it's literally five minutes of content in like three hours. <laughs> we got to play for like 10 minutes. You have Demon Souls? Very low? Yeah, but I need to do the remake. Everyone's gonna bother me about Fortnite? Oh no, it was fun. I had a, I actually had a great time. It was fun yucking it up with the, you know, with the boys. Uh, but if you, I mean, if you're talking about Fortnite gameplay, what you're looking for, that's not what happened. That is absolutely not what happened. The remake is exactly the same. Yeah, but I'm like, I'm, I'm remembering like PlayStation 3. Right? Okay, let's keep going. Oh, the daunting task is almost complete. Because I'm going to be able to burn through a lot of uh, Sekiro really quickly. All right, Index Gundir, I don't need to go up there. Dragon Slayer Armor, that's the one we just watched, but I thought it was a different encounter. We're going to put it up here. They're all Fs. <laughs> No, a lot of, some of the Sekiro fights were really cool. I don't, some of them are probably going to be high. I really didn't like this fight at all. I didn't. Madeir. I didn't really beat it. Half Light, yeah, this is a gimmick fight. It was cool, but let's see. I actually, uh, Vorp was fun. I think Vort's at least a B. First Rod uh, C. Nameless King. Yeah. S. Uh, the Deacons are F. Well, near is uh, somewhere in the seas. And I, when once this is here, I'm gonna make sure it's yeah, it's very accurate. So don't worry. Demon princes. I didn't even remember the fight, so I must not have liked it. Crystal sage, uh, not F, but not it's low C. Abyss watchers, high B, low A. 
put it here for now. Demon Prince is good. Wolner is like a low D. Ah, mm. Freed. Is that Freed and um, Soup Guy? They're stuck in the chair. Yeah. That's up there. It was just, it was crazy. I can't say it was an S though. All right. Soul of Sit and Gunder staying down here. Wyvern, F. Is that fair? We'll find out. Soul of Cinder, C. I C. Or no, that was that was a B. Let's be fair. Okay. Dark Souls three is up there. We just have Sekiro and Dark Souls two. Make sure this is correct. Put some music on. Oh, we had the Hollow Knight one on. That's fine. Yeah, it's getting late. Oh my god, I've been doing this for like four hours! Holy shit! Wow, what? No, I haven't. Have I been doing this for four hours? Why am I so into this? I've been doing this for four hours? I actually can't believe that. All right, I gotta hurry up. Jesus. All right, let's get this correct. Wow. Cool. That was a good, that was a good tuber reaction. Yeah, sometimes. Did you fall asleep? Some of this was Fortnite, was it? No, not this, not the second stream that I turned on. I don't think this was Fortnite. I think that first stream died and I, I did the second one, right? All right, old Demon King. I can stay there. Dancer should be up here. This is gonna get so hard eventually here. Is Dancer cooler than the spirit from Elden Ring? I think so. Probably. And I think Dancer is better than uh, Solo Cinder as well. I think the real test is going over the dragons from Elden Ring. That's the real test. Is Pontiff Sullivan? Yes, they, yes he is. Yes. No. Yes. No. Yes. No. The dragons were snooze? Not in real, were they? I think that, I thought they were okay. Abyss Watcher is, is definitely, I think so. Raid was also cooler than this. Damn. One, two, three, four, five, five bosses from Dark Souls 3 are to A or above. And I still have to put some more up there. Fire Giant was probably... Yeah, Radagon and Elden Beast are better than these. At the very least, I think so. That was a cool fight. I think it goes right against the wall here. You have a McDonald's? Nice. What's your order? I actually think this is a good uh, a good barrier here. Cause that's cooler than Gideon. Crystal Sage, cooler 
Wilnir is higher. I like old Demon King should be in C. You know why Wilnir was awesome because when you went to Wilnir's room, it was just pitch black, and then you keep going, and all of a sudden he's like, "It's like holy shit, what the fuck is that?" I like that a lot. This stays down here. This stays down here. This can go up. Above Nito. And above Renalo. Yeah, this goes down here. That's a gimmick fight, but it was cool. Alright, how we look. I actually think I'm okay with this. I think this is perfect. The only thing I would change up here. Surprisingly low for Madeir. I just, it took too long. It, it, Madeir had way too much health. It was just annoying. You just suck. I think design-wise, Midir was awesome. I just realized the, it just it just way too much health. I remember summoning like four people, and we gave Midir like five, four times more health, and we couldn't even hurt him. I think collectively, the four of us did like thirty percent damage to him. I'll put Millennia up at D. F is for truly. Well, no. F is for dog, like dog shit. Millennia's fight sucks, but is it like the witches of Hemwick? I mean, no, it's not. It's okay. Alright, I'm happy with it. Time for Sekiro. Sekiro only really has a handful, and I, I know, we could probably get a couple of refreshers here. Imagine liking the Melania fight. I mean, it's it, it's not that bad. It's just awful. All right, Sekiro. We need to do a little bit of research here because I, we're looking for. Where, who, who was an actual boss in Sekiro? Actually, I gotta turn this off. Hold on. Okay. Because there was a, there was so many mini bosses in Sekiro. All right, the, all right, all right, right, yeah, 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 yeah. Cool, cool, cool. So. We're looking for the... The names that are uh, orange. So it's not very many. Owl, the fa. I didn't do owl. I don't think I fought that. So that's going to have to go immediately down there. Which I don't know. I don't think I did that. Demon of hatred. I don't know if I did. Did I do that? Chained Ogre is not... Alright, this is this this is the first fight here. This is the one that you die. It's the tutorial one. I don't, I don't... Do I really count it? This is the beginning of the game. The demon was awful for you. I feel like every one of these bosses, I was furious. So I don't know how to even rate these. I hated these. The Owl was a story boss. Did I hate everything in Sekiro? No, I like. I, no, no, no. That's the when everything was burning down. Okay. Let me see if I know where it is. That's where the whole the everything's burning down. I remember the ape was owl. Owl. 
Isn't it where everything's burning? Or is that a different fight? Oh no, I did do this one. Did I? This yeah, this two. It was fun. You had to do this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That one was fun. Okay, what else do we need to see? We need to see pretty much all the major fights. Which are... I don't think that's a major one. Lady Butterfly. Let me remember this. Oh, I remember Lady Butterfly. You know how I know Lady Butterfly? Here's how I know. Um, Every time I've tried to replay Sekiro, I've only beaten Sekiro one time. I always get to this point. Lose like a dozen times in a row and go fuck this game and uninstall it. It's happened, I've, I've tried at least probably three or four times. Alright, so this, how do I even rate these? I hate, did I hate this game? There's the bull. I remember the bull. This was crazy, but it was kind of a cool fight. I remember that. These are all mini bosses. Okay, I remember that one. Right, this is a uh, Ichiro. Right, this is the first time you fight it. Hard equals bad. I didn't say that. Does he turns into lightning moves? Doesn't he? Yeah. This fight was actually pretty cool. Watch yourself play this game. <laughs> I don't know, man. I remember this. This is F. This is the monkey one. We had to run around. This is F. This actually might be below Bed of Chaos. <clears throat> yeah, this is lower than Bed of Chaos. I don't even know if I would count, um... Yeah, this is when you run around and they're all invisible. It's just like not even a boss fight. It's just stupid. Is the Great Serpent even a fight? Don't you kind of just run away, away from it? It's not a fight. It's really cool though. Probably the coolest part of the game. One of the coolest parts. Yeah, the ape. The Guardian Ape, aka uh, the Twitch streamer reaction compilation fight. Where, no, what? He's getting up! No, what the fuck? Dude! It's actually cool, though. I think. This should be somewhere at least in A. It's a really cool fight. Yeah, because there's a that was just the face cams in the corner. What the fuck? No, dude. What? Yeah, I liked it though. This is the gimmick shit, right? This is they throw two at you at the same time. I hate the fake YouTuber voice. <laughs> Yeah, I remember that. Yeah, this is not a real fight. They just give- they put two at you at the same time, which is annoying. Emma? Why do I not remember this? Oh, no, I- wait. Did I fight this? Weren't there- wasn't there an ending you could get in Sekiro that was, like, not even halfway through the game? This is part of that, right? Yeah. I did not do any of these. This is the one where everything's on fire? No. Am I just making up that I did that fight? Or did I watch somebody else do it instead that I did it? I do remember uh, the owl fight though. This fight. Did I, I liked this one, actually. This fight was cool.
This might be one of the best fights in the game. Yeah, I love this one. This is when he, he jumps up in the tree. Yeah, no, it's cool. This is the another bull that's a mini boss. Oh yeah, the big fish. This I wouldn't classify this as a, as a boss either. I wonder how unfair I am to Sekiro. That's not a boss though. Old Dragons of the Tree. Oh, everybody made fun of me for this one. They said this is the easiest boss in the game and I couldn't do it. I remember this. I remember people were like, oh, Mega Lull, like he can't do it. This is the easiest fight in the whole game. Why don't you go up on like pillars and shit and they throw lightning at you? No, this is no, this is different. This is just a deacon fight. Which always goes to D at least. This is the one, the divine dragon. Everyone made fun of me for this. Yeah, this is cool. Even if the fight's easy. This is really, really cool. I remember being awe-inspired by this one. It's beautiful. Yep. Oh, these are mini-bosses. The Demon of Hatred. <laughs> yeah, I, yep, yeah, I know, I remember. I'm getting flashbacks. This fight did suck, though. This fight was bad. Did we get a raid? Did we? We did get a raid. Atrioc! What's up? We're doing a very long, painstaking thing. Uh, welcome, everybody. Hopefully, you had a good stream, Atrioc. We are trying to rate every single boss across every single From Software game. I've been here for about four hours. It's tough. Uh, I have not done Dark Souls 2 yet. We're in the middle of doing Sekiro. Dark Souls 2 is going to be the hardest. And in fact, I might just like, I don't know. It's, there's so many bosses in Dark Souls 2. <sighs> I feel like every boss in Dark Souls 2 for me is the same boss. I don't know why. I remember the Pursuer and you, you shoot him with, uh, with the... The bow and arrow thing. I'll do it. I'll do it. It's not gonna take that long. But yeah, we're, we're going. We're, we're going over, getting refreshers on what the bosses were, so I can remember if I hated them, hated this one. Uh, and then, this, this fight. Yeah. I think I cried during this fight, didn't I? I'm pretty sure I cried. I think I actually cried on camera. Yeah, I think so. I think this took me like 60 to 70 attempts. I cried on camera. All right, I got a good idea. I've got an understanding for Sekiro. Sad, really. <clears throat> it's going to be sad, really. Because I don't think... scary music. I don't think there's anything in S or A in Sekiro. I don't think so. We'll find out. Here we go. So, okay, where, can I put this into like I cried... The fight is awesome. It's such an amazing fight. It's so beautiful. And it's so... 
the moves are so cool. It's such a dance, but my god, I cried on camera. Like, I fucking cried. There were a stream of tears. And I was like, I quit streaming, I quit streaming, I quit streaming! And everyone was like, calm down, and I was like, I fucking quit streaming! And I turned the stream off, and I didn't come back for like a week. Everybody thought I quit. No, I can't put it up. It, I fucking cried. I'm gonna keep it there. Um, Guardian Ape is gonna be A. I think. I don't know if we're gonna get any S from Sekiro. It was just too fucking hard. Lady Butterfly, F. Because even hatred is D. Owl is not. Lady Butterfly is F. Because you keep preventing me from doing another playthrough. The only reason. I keep. I've tried to play Sekiro and I get to Lady Butterfly and I go, why am I doing this? I don't want to do it. So that's, you have to be there. Like, you keep preventing me from playing the game. This was actually awesome, though. So this, let's be fair. Lightning moves. That's probably better than, that is be I'm sorry, it is. Better than Pontiff Sullivan. That was a crazy fight. It was so intense. Why is... Butterfly lower than pinwheel. <laughs> I never said it was going to be perfect. Okay. I didn't, I couldn't do this one. True corrupted monk. Oh, that's the good one. Yep, that's the good one. This is also up here. Monkeys, F. Which, the, which one of these is the real one? Corrupted Monk over... That's the one I'm thinking of, right? The right one? Yeah. That's better. I like that. I like that. These weren't really bosses, and if we're gonna do, if we're not doing mini bosses, then I have to, I can't put them in. Corrupted, no, that's a different game. This is the tutorial in each row, which I don't know if I can even place this. See? No, you're just supposed to die. I'm not gonna place it. Nichiro is already up there. Who is... Yobu? Yobu. Who's Yobu? Yobu? That's the final Genichi Reel. Oh, it's the guy on the horse. Okay, now that was cool. I actually liked that one a lot. That one's B. Um, where are you, Gyobu? Oh, right here. I like that one. It was cool. I don't think it's A, but it's definitely B. Low, mid B. I, 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 this doesn't need to be an I don't know section then. Nitro Way of Tomo is the final version when he transforms mid fight. Ah, alright. Okay. 
That's the one I like. This is the tutorial one, right? I don't want to fuck up Dark Souls 2. We're almost done. Headless Ape. We're in a Corrupted Monk there. These are mini-bosses, right? Oh, these are the ones where you... Okay, I think we're done. Oh, Divine Dragon. Right, Divine Dragon. Beautiful. Just a beautiful fight. Not an A, though. All right. No S's in Sekiro. No S's in Sekiro. Sorry. No Dark Souls 1 S and no Sekiro S. Those are my least favorite games, then they have to be. Unless, well, Dark Souls 2 might be like... I know a lot of people really like Dark Souls 2. But... Dark Souls 2 for me, these are kind of like... Like the left side of the Monopoly map. Like, these are not really worth that much to me. You know what I mean? It's like, these are all Baltic avenues. I don't, I don't know. These are like, you know, Park Place, Boardwalk, like up here. But I don't know, these are, to me, these are all like just Baltic Avenue. Let's see though, I'm not going to talk shit until I do it. Because that's the, that's the finale. And then when I do that, I'm going to make sure it looks right. And then I'm going to see what my favorite game for real is. No bullshit, because you, for, let me, without looking, let me just tell you. Uh, my tier list, but like, not tier list, but my, like, this is where the games sit. Epic. Bloodborne, number one. Elden Ring, number two. Uh, wait. Let me start backwards. Dark Souls 2, bottom. Sekiro, just over that. Dark Souls 1, just over that. Dark Souls 3, over that. Wait! Wait, I need to write it out. This is my, like, you know, like the stupid fucking list. Demon Souls. Dark Souls 1. Hero. Okay, so this is what my list looks like at the moment right now. This is really scary! <laughs> Whatever it is. Is Elden Ring better than Bloodborne? They're the same to me. In my head right now, I can't decide. Done. So that's what I think. We're gonna find out if it's real. Sekiro is done. Let me just check. This is such a huge wall to cross, though. Fuck. Hi, B. It's not Lugarius. It's not. God damn it. I don't know. I think this has to be there. I think that's actually accurate. Because it's better than Legarius. It's better than Abyss Watchers.
Rikard is... No, is he? Done. That it? Dark Souls 2 is the only thing left. Why is there an open can of food on your shelf? There's no open can of food with a fork sticking out of it. Okay. We're almost there. Dark Souls 2. You guys ready? Find out how much we like this game. Here we go. The giant. I remember the giant. Actually, not that bad. It's a pretty good intro. Pursuer. You can kill the Pursuer in, in like two seconds if you shoot the crossbow at him. I like the Pursuer because he chases you. He chases you around. He shows up a bunch of times. It's alright. Dragon Rider. Oh, this is the joke. Laugh out loud. You make him fall off. That's a C. Old Dragon Slayer. I don't even remember fighting this guy. I don't remember. There's so many bosses in Dark Souls 2, I don't even remember fighting them. It looks alright. Oh, this thing was cool. It was the, the sentry. It has the, the two bodies. I, this fight was good. Okay, Ruin Sentinel. This is an F. I remember this was stupid. I hated this. The F for sure. The Ruin Sentinels are absolutely F. Elfrey Gargoyles? F. This is literally just Dark Souls 1. Is it F? Okay. The Lost Sinner. I didn't even fight this guy. <laughs> he looks... <laughs> what about the skeleton lords? This looks like shit. I don't know if... That, I don't think... I think this one sucks too. What about the... What about Slimer from Ghostbusters? I actually remember this fight. This fight was fun. This fight was fun. Yep, I like Slimer. This is probably like a, this is probably a C. Why do these all look like they're in the same exact area? This one I actually was pretty good. That boss is bozo shit. This one's pretty good. Yeah, I remember the scream and dodging. Yep, that was fun. I'm not seeing any A's that I remember as being like, holy shit, that's an A. Smelter Demon. Uh, this is this is bozo shit right here. <laughs> oh, I thought he got, I thought he died. <laughs> This is actually cool. I'm, yep, I remember this. This is probably a B. Smelter Demon and Old Iron King. 
This is the fight I'm talking about where you can fall in. Yeah, this one sucks. D. Executioner's Chariot. Oh yeah, the chariot fight. Dude, playing Dark Souls 2, I it feels like it was a dream. I don't remember, I don't remember any of these things. And I didn't even play it that long ago. Art equals bad, looks like shit, bozo shit, didn't fight him, DLC? What? You should replay it. I I don't know if I want to, I feel like I'll hate it. Uh, this thing is D. I do have a pretty strong memory of this one. I think this fight was cool. Probably like a B. It was pretty fun. Scorpion, it was kind of like the queen from the first game. Yep. Royal Rat Authority. What? That's a dog. How is that not a, why, is that not a rat? I thought Royal Rat Authority was a bunch of rats in the room. Did I play Dark Souls 2? <laughs> that's the other one. Oh, okay. Well, that's kind of, that's a fun dog. Crawling Magus. This looks kind of like, this looks like some bozo shit right here. Duke's dear Freya. Is this the one with the... It's the spider. Yeah, this one was really scary. I like the design of this boss. This boss needs to be higher than the armor spider. Otherwise, I pretended, I pretended to play this game. Which I didn't. I beat it like three times. Ah, here it is. Royal Rat Vanguard. I like the room. I remember fighting these in the room is cool. I'm not gonna give it an S because of rats. I'll give it probably like a C. The rotten. Whoa, oh yeah, this fight. I mean it's kinda of bozo, but it's 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 I would say it's probably high. Not that high. I'm trying to find the one that I'm like, yeah, yep, that one is definitely like A. Two dragon riders. Mm, that's not it. I don't think that's it. I know for a fact a few of these I thought were really good. Maybe this is one of them. Looking Glass Knight. I have a distinct memory of this guy's shield and me being like, that was fun. Okay. I'm looking for one that wows me. It's this one. This is the one with the fucking skull in the mouth of the big frog. Yep. We finally found at least our B. Most people give this an F. I give this a B. Because it's, the design is really, really just carries it completely. Actually, so far, design-wise, the only, like, interesting-looking boss in the whole game so far. Everyone else is kind of just like a... Besides the spider. I don't know. Dark Souls 2 is huge, though. This is so much content. This is the... Velstat? Royal Aegis. I don't have any memory of fighting this. Dark Souls 2 is just like a billion guys in armor. 
Dark Souls 2 is one of the biggest games they have, though. So there's a lot of content. The areas in Dark Souls 2, some of them are really cool. Alright, he's alright. Oh, the dragon in the cage. This thing... Okay, this is high. This is high because you get to see this from a distance for a while, and you go, holy shit, do I actually have to go in there? Yeah, this is probably at least a B. Ancient dragon. Oh, yeah, that's right. You can just come up for- I- No, you can't kill this. This takes way too long. Don't you have to cheese this fight? Isn't this impossible? I don't- I don't want to just hate on Dark Souls 2. I really don't. I don't want to be like that. But doesn't Dark Souls 2 look like it came before Dark Souls 1? <laughs> Is he alive? I- I- it was- I enjoyed myself a lot in the game. I don't want to pretend like I didn't. Right? Giant Lord? It's so simple to sit here and be like, Well, Dark Souls 2 is the worst one. But, I mean, if you do you want more from software content? Would you rather this game didn't exist? Be honest. Like, n no, I'll keep it. I the alternative is this does not exist. I remember these giants there. They were kind of annoying. King Vendrick. This one's not bad. This is how I got into Dark Souls? Yeah. So should there be the Dark Souls 2 section of our kind of map where they're all in C? And they're all in a row? None of these are Fs. You know something? Guys. Dark Souls 2 has no S's and has no A's. But it also has no F's. Interesting. I don't remember any of these me being like this game sucks. That's how you that's a barometer you need to use. Did you fight this enemy and say, this game sucks, fix it? I'm trying to remember. Yeah, this is forgettable. I don't remember saying that this game sucks, fix the game. The ruined sentinels, yeah, that's right. They get one F. Don't you feel like you're you're watching what we're watching in a dream right now? Like this is a, a Dark Souls game that you made up in your head asleep. Like the way the animations are, and the way that the, it's being played, I feel like I'm dreaming this. This is what my brain would put together to say, "Hey, this is like a Souls game." I don't know why. Something about it. It feels like uncanny, but real at the same time. Oh, we've... I rem this is the first time that I'm going to tell you I remember this a lot, and it was really crazy. Yep, this is one of the end endgame bosses. This one's actually really cool. Is it? Do I just want to give Dark Souls 2, like, a spot somewhere in A?
This is literally the final boss before a scholar. Oh, is this the guy that looked like Lord Zed and he comes out of the ground? It is, right? Yep. Yep. Okay, that's probably like a... This is an F boss? <laughs> I don't think any of these are F. I don't. I really... Th I think maybe one of them is. Chandra isn't F. That's adorable. Compare any of these to Dark Souls 3. <sighs> yeah, but... That was a long... A lot of time in between. Yeah, that's kind of cool. The grave robbers. Why did Dark Souls 2 have so many just put three people in a room fights? I don't remember this. I would have hated this. This is mega F. <laughs> is this- this fight's mega F? Is it worse than Bed of Chaos? This is Mega F? What about the, uh... <laughs> Where's the third person? Where's the third player? Where's Sarah the Old Explorer? Where's this other person? This does seem kind of Omega F. Okay, where's the third person? <sighs> Alright, what about the slumbering dragon? Is this cool? I played so much Dark Souls 2 and looking back it may have had some of the worst fights. Is it that? Yeah, this is weird. This feels kind of weird. I don't remember Dark Souls 2 looking this terrible. It wasn't. It was fun. Like, I liked it. It wasn't this bad. No. No, we're, we're being unfair. I think this is- I think we're being unfair. This is without seeing the areas, and Dark, some of Dark Souls 2's areas are really, really cool, and really, like, majestic and awesome looking. I don't think this is Copium. I think it's actually, like, a, it was actually a really fun game. It was. Dark Souls 2 never drops off in quality. Let me read this. Dark Souls 2 never drops off in quality as the second half of Dark Souls 1, you bozos. <laughs> That's actually a good point. Like I said, I, there there are not many F's or D's. It's a bunch of C's and B's. No S's, no A's, no F's. It's very consistent. Even Elden Ring. The last arc of Elden Ring was it was all right. I mean that was the, the whole thing. The whole package was an unbelievable masterpiece. It's consistently bad. I, I don't think so. What about the smelter demon? You've already said three Fs? Is it the Hollow Knight music in the background that's making this seem, like, dumb? I don't know. What's going on? It might be the music. Oh, the fume night. I remember the fume night. Fume night was crazy. What's going on? 
found the health in Dark Souls 2. What was that? What's going on with this health? Slow heal. This I remember this fight was actually pretty crazy. I do remember this one. Sir alone. This was fun too. The timings on these bit were fun. You know what it is about Dark Souls 2? I figured it out. There's no bodies in any of these suits. It's all just metal. It's just nobody's alive. You're just metal suits attacking each other and clinking into each other. Yeah, this fight was fun. What about the king's pet? Yeah, but I, dude, if I was like craving some some Dark Souls, I'd play it. It's not a, it's not a bad game. Yeah, this sucked. Alright, yep, I remember the cat jumping down and then I remember like wanting to uninstall the game. Why though? It's because it's it invisible. Oh. Okay. Blood, the king's pet. Wait, he's this dude again? It's not a bad game. Yeah, this sucked. I wanted to uninstall it. Yeah, but this is... I said... Okay. How many times did you hear me while I was playing Elden Ring? So this thing, I wanted to return the game. What about the Burnt Ivory King? What's going on? Who's the king? Where's the boss? <laughs> This is just open PvP. Bro. <laughs> bro. Somebody said, bro, this is so ugly. <laughs> Everybody's made out of clay and rocks. That's what it's wrong. Where's the Ivory King? <laughs> Bloodborne is uglier? Oh my god, ban that person for life. I mean, I mean it. Ban that person for life. Bro, that looked like battle chess. <laughs> battle chess! Oh, that's- oh my god, you just ruined Dark Souls 2 for me forever. You just ruined Dark- I can't ever play this again. What the fuck? <laughs> okay, you made me want to put this high though, because that's really fun and funny. That's- what a, it's a fun game, leave it alone. <laughs> oh. Leave- leave Dark Souls 2 alone, okay? It's got- listen. It's got some of the most content of any of the From Software games. It might- it might look like a mobile game ad, but- Fuck. I haven't looked back at Dark Souls 2 in a long time. You know, if I was like a Dark Souls 2, like, defender right now, you're probably sitting in the chat going like, Fuck. Fuck. Like. I am a Dark Souls 2 defender. <sighs> Fume Knight is, is the, uh, Fume Knight is, okay, let's do this. And then I gotta make sure it's correct. This is like five hours. I'm a Dark Souls 2 defender, and I'm molding. But that was so- uh, come on, man. Like, that was battle chess. And everyone's made out of, like, like, everyone's made out of, like, pots and pans. <laughs> I 
I like I like Dark Souls too. I do. I really do. I and I, I might it might be fuck. It's literally at the bottom of my list, but they're all good. All right, let's do it. Doom Knight. Let's put the ones we know that are high high. It's Doom Knight cooler than the Taurus Demon. Where is our, where's the barometer? It's Godfrey, right? Is Fume Knight better than Godfrey? You know, I think so. I actually think so. I do. I even think Fume Knight is better than the Blood, Blood Starved Beast. But that's where it ends. We gotta give it to him, guys. We gotta give him at least one encounter that's over the C minus threshold. I'm not done. What any of these? Where's the? Where's the? Where's that fight right here? The burnt ivory king is fucking high. Okay, it's really high because that was hilarious, and comedy sometimes trumps gameplay a lot of the time. Comedy. Can make gameplay look stupid. I'm telling you right now, the that battle chest comment makes this funner than the Elden Beast. I would have more fun walking around hitting those guys and watching them play battle chess than doing the Radagon Elden Beast combo again. I think that's okay being there. Wait, watch the intro to the Burnt Ivory King. Why? Okay, this stays there. I love this. This is... I love this. It reminds me of the boys, it does. Some of them are standing still, do you see? That guy just drank a potion, and he didn't get hit. Yep, I'm... S comedy trumps all sometimes. Sometimes comedy trumps all, and that's where it belongs. It's not go I'm not giving you S. In fact, it's going here. It's stay- alright, it's staying right here. I don't... Okay, the chariot is D. That, that sucked. Skeleton Lords was D. The Slimer Demon is D. C. The Medusa fight was actually pretty cool. We'll do high C. I don't think that's cooler than uh, Godfrey, though. Old Iron King, I forgot what it was already. Smelter Demon, I forgot what it was. The Rotten, this one was... This one was kind of fun. This is like another Slimer. Demon of Song. Seven. Oh, the music turned off. That was weird. Oh, the music turned off. Video paused. Are you still watching? Continue watching? Thanks for confirming. Did I just get Netflixed? I, I gotta go. I've been sitting here for like so long. 
Okay, we're, I want the Demon of Song. This is definitely not cooler than any of the Sekiro fights. Is there a Sekiro fight that's... Yeah, okay. You can stay down here. Uh, The Scorpion was pretty cool. See, Royal Rat Authority. I mean, everyone was laughing at that. It was like a, it was like a Scooby Doo dog with the tongue hanging out. I didn't even fight this. I was gonna put it down here. Howling Magus and Congregation. I, I don't remember. I don't remember fighting this. The Last Giant. That's the first boss in the game. I'm gonna give it a good uh, low C. Duke's dear Freya. That one was not that bad. Probably like a high low C. Twin Dragon Riders is. That's a low C. Looking Glass Knight, that's a high C. Not better than Fume Knight. Not better than Godfrey. Royal Aegis, this one was pretty cool. Low B? No. High C before Godfrey. Bendrick, this was a D. No, this is a low C. Ancient Dragon, F. Guardian Dragon is like a C. Giant Lord is like a, like a C. Dark Lurker? Um, I don't think I fought this. Pursuer, that's a... Pursuer was pretty fun. It was pretty challenging. I'll give it like a C. Throne Watcher and Throne Defender. That, I'll give it a C. Chandra. I'll give it a... I'll give it a C. Scholar of the First Sin. That's the funny guy that's in the ground. I'll give it a C. The grave Robbers, everyone said give that an F. I don't even remember fighting it. Dragon Rider has comedy points because you can make him fall off the edge, and that's pretty cool. I like that. E. Uh, the Queen was pretty cool. I'll give it a C. Slumbering Dragon was pretty cool. I'll give it a high C. Smelter Demon, I'll give it a C. Sir Alone, this one was pretty cool. I'll give it a C. King's Pet F. King's Pet F. I actually like this boss. It's going high. This, this, the design of this boss alone is cool. It is cool than Godfrey. Where's Godfrey? It's cooler than Godfrey, for sure. Where the fuck is Godfrey? Where's Godfrey? Oh, wow. You're way higher than Godfrey. You're cooler than the Godskin Noble. They overdid this. I'm putting it down. Dragon Slayer, I'm going to give it a C. Gargoyles, a D. Ruined Sentinels, F. Lost Sinner, I'm going to give it a C. Royal Rat Vanguard, I'm going to give it a D. Well, no, I'll give it a C. Okay. I got to get this right. Top row is done. Now it is. I need silence for this, because this is really important. This is the thing people are going to point to, to say that I'm like a piece of shit for the rest of my life. I have to make sure this is correct. This is one of the most important things I've ever done on stream, because some of you after this are going to hate me for the rest of your life. 
Oh, I gotta see what I gotta see what happens here. Gas coin better than uh, no. This is a this was a cooler fight. Sullivan cooler than gas coin. Yeah. Deeper toss cooler than gas coin. No. Any of these cooler than Ebri toss? Yes. Yes. Bloodborne is losing a lot of ground here. It's Dark Souls 3. Oh no! No, Sekiro sucks. I refuse to give it S. I'm kidding, it's fine. <laughs> Dark Souls 2. I don't think I can move any of these. Fuck. B is just as important as A, though, because some of these might have to level up. No, 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 no! No! Yes. 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 Oh, fuck Mog. And fuck Rykard, too. The answer is cooler than Mog. You know what? So is Ishin, and, and, and so is, uh, Yobu. Gaping Dragon is not cooler than any of these. What is this doing up here? The music in this is so good. Mm. I think Wet Nurse goes down. Below Tree Sentinel. That was just such an insane, awesome moment when you open up the door and Limgrave is there and there's the Tree Sentinel. It's like, wow, the graphics. I can... Wow. Shit, Sekiro is way better than I thought it was. You put Commander Nile above Margit. 
Thank you for the correction, you're right. Is this good? Is B good? This fight didn't last long enough. It would have been A. It just was a massive DPS race. Mm -mm. These are like the same kind of fight, and this one was cooler by far. This is cooler than this. Cooler than that, too. No, it's not. Vort's way too high. Vort and, and Wolnir make sense at the same spot. Gundir is in the wrong spot as well, but cooler than this. These are way too high. Way too high. I think this is too low. I think that's in a perfect spot. Okay. Um, Dark Souls 2. Oh, okay, everything in Dark Souls... Is every single boss in Dark Souls 2 that's not the ones I put high better than the Taurus Demon? I mean, I don't know about that. Put these down. Put this up. All the Dark Souls 3 stuff goes up now. Except for this. Cleric Beast goes down. Fuck this fight. It's stupid. It's the worst fight in the whole game. But it's better than everything in Dark Souls 2. Hold on. I gotta make sure I do this right. Dark Souls 2 is like the sea. No, I, that can stay there. So can that, and so can this. The gold skin duo is bad. Gimmick fight. These are cooler than the Taurus Demon. They are. Old King is cooler than Taurus Demon as well. Way cooler. I'm swi I'm flop I'm swapping these. Moon presence has to come way down. Fuck. This is too high. I think that's in a good spot. See, the scale is sucks. Um. But it's cooler than Godfrey. And it's cooler than the old hero. Is it cooler than the Fume Knight? I'll say yes. What, I, what the really important one is, what is the worst fucking thing I've done in an ever in a From Software game? Oh, I think that's good. These are all the same to me. I'm put, that, that's where it belongs. To me. And I have to be honest. Okay. What's the worst thing I've ever done? Ever. In a ROM software game. This is pretty low. It's always Bed of Chaos. I hated this so much, though. I did. I hated it. This is probably worse, and so is this. The Deacons are probably worse than that as well. Dragon God's worse than that. The Grave Robber shit? I mean, it's bad. These are all bad. Ruined Sentinels are bad. 
Probably the worst. No, maybe. They might be. It's possible. Deacons could be the worst. Is it done? Done. Millennia is better than the fucking goddamn skeleton lords, right? Like, I gotta be fair. I'm trying to think. It's better than... Uh, Millennia is better than Pinwheel. Pinwheel, come back. Pinwheel, go to F. I refuse to put it higher than D. I just hated that fight so much. Lady Butterfly is only there because it prevents me from playing the game anymore, and it's an encounter you have to do. I'm done. Stamp it. Sign it. Done. It's over. <clears throat> All these are mini bosses or, you know, stuff that I can't really place. It's over. What about Morgoth? Yeah, I made the joke about, oh, I can't place more god, but I'll place him. It's cool. There you are. It's over. There is my official From Software boss tier list. It only took us about five hours. Butterfly is optional, you're a dumbass. So what, what's my, what game do I like the most? Um, okay, we're gonna count what, how many games are, how many bosses are in S, A, or B. We'll start with Bloodborne, because it's right here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There are nine bosses here from Bloodborne. One, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Those demon cells. Twelve, thirteen, fourteen from Elden Ring. Dark Souls 3. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 12 versus 14. And there were way more bosses. Way more bosses in Elden Ring. Dark Souls 3 might be my favorite one. Like, if boss encounters wise. If we're just talking straight up boss fights, I think Dark Souls 3 has the best boss fights. Below that, I think Bloodborne and Elden Ring both kind of are tied for me in boss encounters. Although I think Bloodborne has a, edges it a little bit more. Dark Souls 3 is baby easy. Whatever. And Sekiro, though. Four, five, six, seven. There are, there are nine. There, I liked Sekiro, apparently, the boss fights, as much as I liked... Bloodborne. Kind of, right? I guess I'm surprising myself that I actually did sort of like that game. What about the Fs? This is important too. Holy shit, I don't I don't give a fuck about Dark Souls 1 at all. 
One. Two. Is it? What about the D's and F's? Lots of Dark Souls 1 and D. A lot. Damn. Huh. If you take the aggregate, I think Dark Souls 2 has a better score than Dark Souls 1 on this tier list. I mean, there's way more Dark Souls 2 bosses. That's not fair. A lot of Elden Ring in D as well, though. But there was like a fucking hundred of them. Alright, that's cool. I still think my opinion stands. That's Demon Souls. Oh, right. Not Elden Ring. Dark Souls 1 unironically sucks. It was just better than Demon Souls. I actually liked Demon Souls better than Dark Souls 1 because you could fast travel. And you have to wait till like two thirds plus more than halfway through the game to, to travel in Dark Souls 1. I think that Dark Souls 1 is way higher than... Am I lying to you? If you told me right now, would you rather start playing Dark Souls 1 right now or Sekiro? I would probably say Sekiro. Yeah, I think so. But part of that, I think, has to do with the fact that I have played through Dark Souls 1, like, probably five to ten times. I've only played through Sekiro once, so that's probably one of the reasons why. Dark Souls 1 is just a solid video game <clears throat> that kind of... It was right after Demon Souls was cool, and everybody, well, wow, that was a cool concept. They made Dark Souls 1 this interconnected world. It was a cool experience. It was unlike anything else that anyone ever played. It's just old. Like, older. And it's hard to put it above stuff that came 10 years later from the same company that is effectively the same video games. And even still, like somebody just said, it is it is unlike anything else still, because they got rid of the interconnected world where you run from place to place and you don't fast travel. They got rid of that. Sekiro's level design was really good. It was. Maybe I unnecessarily hate Sekiro for no reason. Maybe it was, it was just hard. And I remember being I remember crying. If Melania didn't have the one bullshit move, where would she be? We have to live in reality. Waterfall is fine. Laughing my ass off. And when you make your... When you make your um, tier list, you can put Millennia, Blade of Mikola, up here. But there's no chance in hell that Melania is cooler than Garmin. Uh, that's not happening. Nameless King, not happening. Inichiro, not happening. Freed, not happening. Pontiff Sullivan, not happening. Better than, than Ligarius? Not happening. Better than Abyss Watchers? I'll give you that. Better than Ornstein and Smog? Not happening. This is really unfair. Yeah, I just hate it. I'm just mad at this because that's the last I just did it and I hated it. Okay, give me like two months. Ask me again and she'll probably be like up here. Ornstein is smog overrated. I, a lot of people think I have this underrated. I thought I put it in a good place. 
This is a good tier list. Not happening. Fine. We're not doing. Uh, no, no, we're not doing this again. I. That was fun though. That was just I'm just chilling, just doing this. What a weird stream. I played in a Fortnite tournament. And I did a five hour from software tier list. What a fucking weird stream this was. Had a good time. I don't like the fact that the internet kept having problems for no reason. Like somebody was like going like this to the wire. I don't get it. It's annoying. It was five. Yeah. The, the, dude, what the fuck is the Fortnite? The, the one guy that came in for the Fortnite question. Ugh, I feel so bad. That, that person's going to go to the VOD and just like scroll through and be like, this is fucking stupid. This guy had to resort to doing magic tricks because he doesn't know how to play Fortnite and he joined a tournament. I, I put money into Fortnite. I bought a skin. You missed the magic tricks? You did. That was the big nose of yours? Sure. I have a crooked nose. Do you know that? My nose is crooked. See how it goes that way? Like it goes like this. It's way more pronounced going this way, right? Like that. My nose is like this. Uh, link to the tier list. Yep. I will. I think it's a pretty good list. I think it's... I mean, obviously Dark Souls 2... I don't want to hate Dark Souls 2, and I think it's not fair. I think it's a good... Big... Ja, I almost said junk. A bunch of... It's good. I liked it. I do like it. I had enjoyed my time in it. I played through it a couple times. Osiris is the most forgettable thing in the game. It shouldn't be at A. Well, it should be at A, but it should not be higher than that. That's what you meant to say. Because, I mean, it's not cooler than that. It's not. Okay, now we're done. Will you do more magic tricks? Or Dark Souls 2. I feel bad. It's okay. Alright, let me link to the, uh, to the... Let me link to it. Alright, I'll see you guys later. That's the end of the stream. Kind of a weird one today, but, you know. The next stream! By the way... Is going to be... Today is Tuesday... I will see you guys on Friday? Set maybe Friday or Saturday? Let's say let's say Saturday. We'll do Saturday, Sunday. Is this the time where we pick to do uh Elden Ring invasions and PvP and stuff? That might be a fun time to do it on Saturday like afternoon. And that will wrap up a lot of the Elden Ring <clears throat> stuff. And then Sunday, uh, you know what? Why don't we go play DOS games? I think DOS Sunday sounds fun. I'll get a bunch of uh, crazy shit. We'll do some DOS games. So if you want to do Elden Ring multiplayer, Saturday is the day. Put it on your calendar. You gonna do a fight club? Uh, I think I'm just gonna... We'll put a password down and I'm just gonna put my sign somewhere. Let's see what happens. I moisturize. I actually really do that, seriously. Your 30 to 40 year old self will be very happy with you. Dude, battle chest, that might be my favorite one guy of the year so far. 
That was an amazing comment. Did you see the R play stuff? I did. I've been keeping up with it. Although, isn't it over? It ended, right? Yeah, it's over. Link the tier list. Um, I, I, I did. Uh, I did, didn't I? There you go. What's the moisturizing routine? Right out of the shower, dry your face. Use a light moisturizing cream. Make make sure it's for your face. Light. None of this heavy, heavy, like, like cream shit. None of they don't like the hand cream stuff. No, no, no. Get a light face moisturizer, water based. The ones that are gel. They're kind of like a watery gel. That's what you want. When you get out of the shower, you dry your face. Kind of pat it dry for a little bit. Get your light, kind of water gel based face lotion. Just the tip of your middle finger, that's all you need. Work it into your hands a little bit, maybe tap it on the cheekbones, rub it in all around your face. Do that every day. Skin routine. It's really good for you. It is. It helps. All right, guys. It's late. I'm going to get out of here. Thanks for watching Fortnite? Um, question mark. And the From Software tier list. This is a weird one. But sometimes they're weird. I really the, the hanging out and doing the tier list is was fun. It's cool just to kind of look at stuff and hang out with you guys. Doesn't have to be like crazy, right? They don't all they don't all have to be crazy. In fact, none of them are crazy. I'm a normal person. I'm a regular guy, and I'm not. A, I don't do crazy things. We relax and do a tier list. Dude, that's what we do. Uh, if you're still here from Atrioc, thanks for the raid. Hope you enjoyed yourselves. And I'll see you guys on Saturday. Have a great night. Take care of yourselves. Bye.